need to know. Oh god, that's loud. Not here for need to know. And we're a mutant. That was a freeze screen, in case you were wondering. This is my little character that kind of looks like, um, what is it? Rocket the raccoon from... Yeah, Rocket the raccoon. Nico's here with me too. From, uh, oh, help me here. You heard me say from like 30 times and you were like, she'll figure it out on her own. Mm. Anyway, it's though. an open world RPG in which you play as a mutant of sorts. He's a customizable character that you put together at the beginning. I will post up later um, gameplay of the first 30 minutes or so of Bi Mutant in which I created this character. It, it, it took some doing created this character and um, went ahead and started the tutorial. Um, as you can see here, the world is pretty nice. It's nothing that you're going to look at and be like, my eyes are bleeding out of my skull. But keep in mind, I am playing on PS4. Um, maybe on PS5, it'll be incredibly gorgeous and wonderful. These horses over here. Nico loves them, don't you, Nico? Hmm. They look like if you took the monster from Concrete Genie and slapped it onto a buffalo or an alpaca. Look how it lays down! They are harmless and they are- I, I like them. I think they're cute. Nico's like, no, I'm not feeling it. Look at him! Oh, we're friends. Those look terrible. It looks like the ghost from Black Desert. And yes, I am in fact an animal riding an animal. A, a bipedal animal riding a-, a Quadrupedo? Yes. Animal. Quadruped? God, words are hard. Um, you might also notice that I'm kind of dressed like a shogun of sorts. It's just a result of the tribe the that I've... You. You're good. You're good. <laughs> I am good. I am real good. Um, so we're going to be fighting rival tribes today, trying to overthrow the world, as it were. Story of Bi Mutant is that... Nico, I'm going to need you to read chat messages to me, by the way. I don't... Yeah, he's just said, wow. Well, you gotta say wog back. Did you wog Grim? He he waits for that, you know. It looks like there's something behind that waterfall. Is there something behind that waterfall? Oh goodness. You don't swim too well, by the way. So that's that's a thing to watch out for. There is a thing behind the waterfall. Ha ha. They look like creatures from Shadow of the Colossus. Oh, that too. Except you know, mini. What's back here? So yeah, the world has ended, post-apocalyptic, the animals are all that's left, and everything is mutated. Everything is... You might be wondering about the title. The, the silly part, everything in this game has a ridiculous name. What the hell is a strap clamp? House patch. Normal. Clamp trap! Oh, it's not as, that's trap. not as ridiculous as they get, though. There's things to loot. You don't loot. Fruta Squeezo. And now, I understand that what they're trying to do here is is reconstruct a world that that someone who isn't familiar with the way things used to be before the world ended would look at it. Like, y you of course would describe something differently if you hadn't been part of a civilized world where a, a juice box was called a juice box. You'd be like, well, hmm, there's fruit in this and you squeeze it. Fruit squeeze. That's the name of this now, sort of thing. But like, it's real hard to take seriously. And at some <laughs> point, oh, my, my mount returned to me. You might have noticed I left him here without a face, and now he's got goat horns. Yeah. Oh, hi, buddy. He's looking at me like he's not impressed. It's fine. I get that a lot. But if you go here, and then the uh, Wong Fu. We practice Wong Fu here. Kung Fu wasn't good enough for us. We added a W to kind of differentiate. Wong Fu. Now, my character is a Sobator, which means it uses dual weapons. I don't currently have dual weapons. I am using the... um the tribe weapon which is bequeathed to you after you've done enough for the tribe that you allied with. This time I'm trying to be a total asshat so you'll notice hmm. it's somewhat dark. Hello Nico. She's over there somewhere. Wow, um, wow. Somewhat dark and no light whatsoever so you see the little evil dragon over there. Every now and then the game will give you a an opportunity to make a decision that will impact this aura. And then over here we have mutations. You can get psi powers, which are abilities you use during combat. I don't have enough um, aura. I don't have enough of a leaning to be able to get the next. I need one more in my dark aura. So I've just got to continue to play the story. And be a dick. 
and be a dick. Unfortunately, oh. um, I ran into the the sort of open world RPG wall where it's like, I don't really feel like doing the main story. I think I'm going to try to do other things. Yeah. And everything is on my level. Just everything. It it upset me. But, you know, we're here. Like that weird here. fuzzy lizard you had last night. Here I am, a Soba tour. Yeah, I... Uh, I fought a lizard in a onesie earlier, like a big ass Komodo dragon sized lizard. It was the hardest thing I've done so far in my about five hours of play. A, a Komodo dragon, imagine it, in a teddy bear onesie. So like it's the pajamas and then the hood goes over the Komodo dragon head with the little fuzzy ears on top. Silly. Yeah. It's just silly bio points. That's what I'm trying to look for. So you can mutate or rather learn new skills. The mutations, I had hoped that they would kind of reflect on your character. They don't really. As far as like if I learned mud punch, I'd suddenly get like a, a earth arm or something. You also have a, a gun. Currently mine is a rifle. You start out with a pistol. You can get a shotgun. And um, combat's pretty smooth. You can switch between the two. You seem I to will have made a new friend. He's my old friend. I will head to this rival outpost and show you guys the combat because it's it's nice and smooth. This is currently owned by me, so there's not any. Oh, I have that already. There are mounts in the game. They're different. Well, they're all notes, goats with an N. You know, G N O A T, note. You also. I'm gonna go this way. Ooh, shiny! There's all sorts of resources to collect via these little towers, planks, and you can build your own weapons and equipment. I haven't yet experimented with that too much. I haven't found the parts that I need. Sounds ridiculously adorable. Which one? The note? Oh, I don't know. I'm just Here's reading the map. Reading chat. It's pretty big. Yeah! How the hell do I- okay, zoom out. So I've only discovered about this much so far. And then here. So the main story of Biomutant is that to save the world from certain destruction, you have to get the world eaters off of the Tree of Life, Yggdrasil, for those of you who enjoy Celtic, Celtic things. But um, they're all these big beasties just munching away at the roots of the Tree of Life, and there's four of them. I haven't yet fought one of these beasties, I'll get around to it. You said Hopefully. the uh, the lizard thing. Oh, the Komodo. Yeah, I I, I tagged you, Grim. Um, I took a screenshot of it because I was like, what the fuck is it this? It was the strangest thing. It just came out of nowhere, you know? It's and beat the hell out of me. Yeah. I've been finding like health packs and I was like, I never use these. What do I even need these for? No, 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 no. I used, oh, you're okay. I used like 10 health packs just on that alone. And don't say it's because I'm bad, because hmm. I'm, I'm... It's no, the, it, it I'm was okay. really difficult Ooh, for money. it being, what, the, simil the same level as you? It was still hard? Yeah, it was level 7 and I'm level 7 or 8. Yeah. That that I just jumped through is actually the currency in this world, which are leaves. I mean, particular kinds of leaves, because as you can see by all this foliage... Stories keep sort of moving thing. whether you drive them or not. That is the narrator. He will say random things for random reasons. Like, sometimes you'll just be galloping across, like, he's like, when night falls, danger is around. Like, it's a nice day, sir. Are you talking to me? Let's enjoy this, this lovely stroll through the bamboo. Okay, this is not mine. These are enemies. Okay, I'm gonna leave you here, buddy. See you in a bit. So combat is kind of hack and slash, and you have those mutant abilities that I mentioned. If you hold down L2, they come up. So currently I have the ability to to flash towards them. It does enemy or damage when you smack into them. A fire roll, you which leaves damage on the floor. Um, it takes key to be able to use these, KI. So you it'll slowly regenerate up at the top there. But otherwise what you're doing is comboing attacks together and Hopefully dodging, which I'm not doing. There's also a, a parry system, which makes it super helpful to avoid damage. And of course, there's your gun. Um, the game auto locks. You can't lock onto any particular enemy. It's just whoever is closest to you. So you'll find yourself moving a lot. His name is Rhino Sorbet. Good example of silly. Um, so you'll find yourself moving around a lot to avoid getting struck because you're always outnumbered. It's never just one enemy. It's a little herd of these critters. 
And there's the comic book, I don't know if you just saw that, where it said Foxtrot or something. There's the comic book effect where um, it'll say flap and bop yeah. and other It kind of reminds me things. of uh, Beautiful Joe. Foxtrot, which is the move I just used. I gotta watch out because he's gonna get me. The big one is who I'm avoiding currently. It's not. It's not me. It's me. Mm. <laughs> yes. So yeah, you'll wanna you'll wanna turn your camera around quite a bit because you never know who's trying to sneak up on you from behind. And that's, enemies that's do probably. have a tendency to just like run up on you. Probably a real good tip for just living life in general. Like, hey, you don't let people sneak up behind you. That's that's not a fun time for anybody. Nah. I mean, unless you're into that. If Surprise. You're into that, <laughs> Surprise! I didn't know I wanted that. And I'll just bleh. And the the third skill I have is just me throwing up, which is useful, I guess. A lot of the enemies too are uh, the majority of the enemies you'll face are probably um, opposing tribes. So pay attention to yeah. You know, so the current area I'm in, you'll see a lot of these little turbaned dudes. Rubber grip it's for a new weapon. I like the fire roll, but it doesn't seem to be that effective. It's not. <laughs> and there's no way Heroes to, for the to level scores. them up either, so it's it just seems like a fun diversion. Like, we, I can fire roll. Okay, now I gotta go back to actually... It seems more like a mild inconvenience. Kung fuing. Like, a, like a mosquito, like, oh, this is Like, I was really happy about it. I was like, me. oh, it does, it does damage over time. That's the kind of thing I'm into. And fire, I am definitely a pyro, but then I was just underwhelmed by how it did. Now all your health will regenerate after you get out of combat. You'll see a lot of these too. Like, like it looks like they went to war at some point and there's just like remnants of that. I guess to make the world seem as though yes, it's been ravaged by some sort of otherworldly fight that happened. Of epic proportions. Right, of larger proportions than what you're seeing. Because for the most part, the world has been quite empty. The like you don't run outpost. The Mighter Mop meditated here long ago. Also a silly name, but it also seems like I don't know. A few of the cutscenes lead lead me to believe at one point there may have been humans, but well, yeah, I, I guess like everybody, all the, the humans are dead. In the before four times, like they'll say yeah. ridiculous stuff like that. Also because very thematic because you're an animal when you get to an area you get to pee on a stick. Well, just pee in general. Uh, don't yeah. worry, he's fine. It's, it's usually that color. But it, it reveals a little bit more of the map, so you can see where you are. And yeah, I this is this is it. This is where I need to be. I mean, it's pointing over there, but I'm pretty sure that's where I need to be. I haven't. It said new thing. When you run, you actually run on all fours, which is yeah. There's my buddy. Hello. You look like me. This is sir. <laughs> says they've been waiting for you. They're ready to bring death and destruction to the outpost. Let's do it. They scouted the outpost last night. It seems like a challenge you'll be able to overcome. So you'll notice no characters actually speak. They do this gibberish thing, which I guess would be like Simoleon. Animal speak. You go to Simoleon. No, honey, that's not Um, looking for a new home. The moths should infest the place. Oh, okay. Let's. Do that's the idea. If everything works out as planned, the moths should cause a buzzing tumult. I think you and I um, have different ideas of what a moth is. I guess we'll go look. This should be perfectly horrifying. Stir up the moth nest is my next objective. Oh, okay, well, first of all, moths are underground. And what's this? A mushroom? Can I touch it? I can't actually, but, but I want it. How do I touch it? You don't. It feels like an ancient dungeon. Climbing. You found a climbing spot. Oh, oh, it just marks that I can go down. Interesting. Use normal movement controls to move to the next ledge. Jump away to stop climbing. Oh, it just repels down the side. Okay, helpful. Uh, yeah, so most characters have the same voice because they speak gibberish and then the narrator is here to, That's to the translate. That's the over there. Again, I mean, I'm not understanding what moths in this world look like, but uh, oh. just get to it and destroy it. Okay, and here we go, more turban guys. That's just who we happen to be fighting right now. This you is the the current tribe, right? The the, the only other tribe, uh, the myriad. Yeah. Okay. They're called the myriad. 
I should switch to the other weapons I have. You can- switching is actually pretty easy, it's hot keyed to uh, holding down the buttons you'll see under my face there. How did that miss? <laughs> Loop. That's how. So if you hold this down, you can actually switch to your other weapons. Because I'm du dual-handed, I have to do it twice, which is unfortunate, but then the, the feel of combat changes a little bit, and the, the special moves do too. Unstoppable Pig is the name of the main one for this weapon. But yeah, you switch seamlessly between ranged and melee. They're so far have been no points to sink into range, so I'm not sure how you can power it up. Because you have your typical stats like strength, vitality, uh, uh, what's it called? Charisma, etc. So they, they help with different things, which we specify. And none of them have told me, like, hey, by the way, this will make you better at range. There wasn't any accuracy. Speed actually just makes you move faster, which I've been kind of... that's a flesh wound. I've been kind of sinking points into that because it's been keeping me alive. I should probably do more Vitality. I, I'm a little, a little squishy. Just a little bit. Also has that neat uh, sort of like witch time effect like Bayonetta where if you dodge yeah, at the right moment. Yeah, when you moment, dodge at just the right moment. Which I would show you cool. a parry, but I never know when to parry. Like it gives you the, the, the warning, but like that is when you're supposed to parry. But he'll then switch to his ranged weapon. I'm like, well, I can't parry that. What the hell am I supposed to do here? <laughs> Just keep firing. There's no ammo in this game, though you do need to reload your weapon on occasion. So it's just, just a momentary... Thanks. It's just a momentary inconvenience for you. Can I parry you? You're a big boy. Come here. No. Oh. Okay, well... <laughs> Not like that! <laughs> like, walk, dude! Okay, he's not giving me the little, little buzzes. The, you, I guess, you come across weapon, I guess, what, mods that last a very short duration, too, like fire bullets and stuff. Yeah, I was confused by that. I picked up, like, a scope for my rifle. Let me just switch back to the rifle. And, like, after a few shots, it was- oh, I thought you were dead, I'm sorry. After a few shots, it was it was spent. Like it was a nice fire scope, you know. It Seemed did damage like over time. Like never ever. It's a good night, sir. Hmm. <laughs> what? Is it? Is it a good night? It's a pretty good night. It's a quiet night. We're. I need to get the other side of this wall. Maybe this way. It all looks the same. Just a series of. T oh well. Well, that answers the question. His name is High Rise. Silly, silly. Now, when you're in that menu where I just changed my weapons, it doesn't actually pause the game, so I'm gonna change from here, that way I'm not having this thing run up on me while I'm not back. I can't change my gun here, can I? Sad face. No. Ranged? No. In There's under no, gear? No. Oh. It's just, like, you have different equipment, of course, so head, you have a helmet, face, the mask, you got two two shoulder pads, and then in your main hands are gonna be your melee weapons. And then legs, of course, pants, torso, the jacket. Uh, yeah, there's no way to change my... God damn it. Wait, no. Okay, that's... My Pew Pew Box Praka is what I'm currently using? No, this is. Okay. Yeah, this is the pencil, which is a little quicker, and I'm gonna go past you, excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> okay, rude. So rude. But yeah, like I said, you'll never come into just like one enemy that's here. It's always gonna be a group of friends just kind of hanging out in a cave together. Which is fine. I mean, if you're a cave-dwelling typhoon, that's more power to you, buddy. I think this, this is actually not helping me. I can't see past the fire. But yeah, it, it was very slight fire damage there. Like, oh no, we were on fire for just a bit. How inconvenient. You. You need to stop that. But they have all the same weaponry available to them, so they, they will fire at you when they can. Ching? Oh no. 
I never try to get close to a big enemy, because they can pin you, they can lift you, and all their such fun things that make it so that life is not happy. And some can smack you once and you'll pretty much have no health, so... Yeah, that lizard thing, it was just like, hey, you're pinned in place, by the way, and now... God damn it, I got too close to him. <laughs> you're pinned in place now, and haha, have my way with you. I have no ammo. Wow. That's the reason I, I switched from this pistol, like, a few shot shots, and it's like, oh damn. I'm gonna go find something else to do. Your energy is empty. Yes, yes it is. Thank you. But that's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Like everything. Everything. Awesome. I might have to heal. I don't like using the healing items. They're a crutch. I'm strong. Maybe. Yeah, we'll do the chargey thing and the shooty thing and the. I should probably heal. Fine. Fine. Oh no, I got it. Ah. The Super Wong Fu thing came up for just a brief moment and it was too late. The narrator, in case you guys are wondering, is actually the cricket on my shoulder. I don't know if you can see him. He's casting a light currently. You are rude, sir. He's just doing what he's been told, honey. Trying to kill you. It's starting to add up. What? Oh, yes. Mm hmm Thank you, narrator. That's that's what's happening here, yeah, I'm, I'm hitting things. Alright, that's two dead. That's just this big guy. Let me... Let me... Could you... Uh, put some... Bullets in this gun, and then we'll... Oof. And then we'll get punted, is how that's gonna work. That's exactly what I meant to do, yes. Hmm. It's just easier to shoot things, like... And again, I know I make this look so hard. Oh. Because I'm focused. I'm so focused on what I'm doing. Exactly what I'm doing. Could you could you be a deer and just walk into that? Yeah, that's fine. That's great. Come on. Walk back this way. You're doing great. You're doing great. Nope, not that. I need you to I need you to calmly walk through my fire. Thank you. Does the combat feel smooth enough? The combat does feel smooth, yes. Like I said, they, they tend to do the cheap thing. You saw he just kept charging me while the little ones were shooting at me, which cannot be in any way, like, uh, blocked. But other than that, I, I have no complaints about it. I actually like it. Oh, wrong one. Uh, this one. So you need this special fist to be able to break through these walls like this. So it has things like, um, in... I don't know, Legend of Zelda, where you need a specific item to get past a, a locked door of some sort. You can also use this fist to fight. I haven't nice been. Work. I'm not. No more moss nest. Wow. Okay, what does that do? I'm so curious. About to see. Maybe. What? The, no the moths are gonna are gonna attack and there we go okay. there go the moths toward the outpost they're good and mad the Again. outpost belongs to your tribe now wait what well, that was easy i didn't even have to fight huh i mean are moths really that dangerous uh, they didn't do he anything but like them weaker, it seemed like a mild inconvenience like my firepower your yeah. seafood mild inconvenience. thanks you your tribe is growing stronger Woo, I did a thing. So every time you defeat one of the rival tribes, whoever you side with or or uh, ally with to fight against, um, your tribe will move on in and set up a little camp so that you can buy new mounts and new weapons and new clothes. And they'll also give you like little little things or the weapon that I was using earlier, Thinks the staff. Thinks you did a great job capturing the rival's third outpost and Thank believes you. the rival is weak enough to engage them at their fort. Oh, I might be able to kill the, the rival tribe Says now. they won't stand a chance against you. Damn right they won't. <laughs> Rude. I worked hard for the money. See, we're twinsies. Yeah, he just gave me this outfit after the last outpost. Yeah. But I do like that there are alternative ways to, to, to defeat one of these outposts. Like the one before this actually just threatened the guy and he was like, you know, Probably not a good idea to fight you, I give up, I surrender. And in this one, all I had to do was overthrow some moths. 
Now, I start, I'm sorry, I know I'm in the way here, but the top one is Vitality, which adds to your health and armor. Strength is melee damage. Intellect, which, as you can already see those. So I've been putting a lot of points into agility, as you saw, I was dodging around quite a lot. Charisma allows you to get better prices for your items. I should have Vitality. That's, that's gonna be the smart thing to do, yeah? Everything feels better. <laughs> Pose. That, by the way, is the narrator. The little little cricket back there. Um, I'm not sure why he's a cricket. That's that's what they chose. That's like you know what will strike fear into the hearts of your enemies? A cricket. Hmm. A a mechanical cricket. It seems to be the best thing we can do. Crane dance. Finish your melee chain by fan firing your gun. Oh. Which gun is this? It just says gun. So it must be the basic gun. Okay, I'll learn that. Circle, square, R2. It'll actually remind you, like when Check you're in the middle. The islands when you can. Okay. So circle, square, R2. Oh, that's fun. Okay. I'm I'm with that. So you can learn different combos. Um, they're. I don't know if it's because I'm I'm new and there have not been a whole lot of weapons I've picked up, but there's like two or three additional moves that I've learned on top of like the basic combos. So. Hopefully that'll get a little more complex as we go. Ooh, treasure. So the first thing, as soon as you overturn, this is the sea little, because it covers your eyes. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Um, the first thing I do is always, you know, loot. Just kind of tear out the place and look for things. That is a big book, sir. What you doing? Reading about information life. Information gatherers. Some civilians have information about secret locations nearby. Hmm. Huh. You can also try to ask for information, but it's not likely they'll give up, give it up, oh my, unless you make use of one of your main attributes. Like Pinocchio. If you fail the check, you will lose one of your attribute points. Okay, so this is what I did at the fort. They're like, well, you can try to threaten them, but you'll lose one point in strength. I was like, uh, okay, that's fine. I'm... Says there's an interesting place nearby that no one knows about, but doesn't really want to talk about it right now. Why would you even mention it? That's literally me. Okay, I should hmm. probably save before I do this, but... Not sure if you're likable enough to be let in on it. Aww. Wow, that's rude. Okay, I can risk charisma, which I don't use a terrible lot of. There's no risk at all, but it's very slim chance of success, and then that has... Oh, they're both the same. Should I risk my charisma on a roll, Nico? Just um, like, roll a 19, you suck. Yeah, you might as well. This is how you can tell if you... Uh... But like I said, I don't... I've used... I've added one point to charisma, so that just kind of leaves me back in the... I don't buy a, a whole lot either. You better tell me before you forget. Lol. Okay, your secret is safe with me. Trust me. Says you look trustworthy. Ha -ha! Oh, as well look at that. There it is. My role succeeded. Where are we going? Oh, it's not too far. All right. To a white van. Okay. Says Lobo is the only one with a goblin here. If you want to see it, you'll have to go see her. Who says the hell you should take care. I think of the wolf from uh, Animal Crossing. Lobo? Yeah. This is a lobo. There's I've seen a wolf. Same. They've all looked kind of like, I don't know, very skinny raccoons for the most part. Unless they have a weird or mutation lemurs, which changes or... them drastically. I don't know. They're, they're just all very skinny, upright animals. Just amazing. Watch out ah. crazed gnats. Cuffed Beanie. Well, that's a normal name. Also, who's gonna take me seriously? I'm riding into combat in my beanie and and, and hiking boots and scarf. Yeah? Health patch, gonna need that. What else we got here? Oh, there's one. So for the most part, I have been a screw. Just a single screw, okay. That's gonna be for editing my arsenal, of course. I'd like to find the marketplace. Oh well, more chests. I'm okay with this. Mulchy. Oh, it has ears. Ears on ears. Hell yeah. Because as you could you see can. when I just picked that up, it had a lousy quality. So you can improve upon them if you have the right 
the right parts. This is also ears on ears. I it's look, a bunny. Yeah, the bunny ears. But the Dagny, which is my current tribe, it looks so much better. See a little. I look like an army man here. See a little. I think you need to wiggle it, honey, otherwise. Yeah. Owl mask, which you can see my ears, sort of. I did. I did. Yeah. I did. Okay. <laughs> Please hold while I fix Nico's mistake. Put at the top. Turn off the controller. This? Or switch either. <laughs> 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 Yeah, shut my controller off. Oh, whoops. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well. <sighs> I just wanted to play some Bio Mutant, Nico. He's laughing. Okay, that's th that's how this should look, not whatever. You need to wiggle it. Wiggle. Yes, wiggle it so it doesn't go to sleep. Mongol rugby. Mochi. I like this one. I mean, ugh. And the armor goes down. Like, it's one of those things- I wish you could glamour. I've, I've always said this in any sort of RPG. Why can't I glamour objects so that if I find something cute, but not necessarily practical, I can wear the practical thing and still feel cute. Like what? Nah, why? that's a bit too advanced for this, I think. Why isn't that a thing? This is the year 2021 and I need to be able to wear very, very tight. <laughs> the most penis compressing skinny jeans in the world. <sighs> yeah. Anyway. Like Yosemite Sam. Grant over. I, I just would really like, I think that is the best choice for anyone who's making an RPG. Take note. You need to be able to have items glamourable so that I can still be strong but look good doing it. Yeah. yeah. I, I feel like I'm not asking for much. Kind of like how Cyberpunk started where you pretty much just had to wear so many ugly things that never match. I didn't do that. I just wore whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you. My character could get knocked over with a fucking, a, a fucking breath of air but it looked good. Yeah. And that's the important thing. This is where I started. There's my Sifu. He just stands there until I find something else useful to do with myself. Okay, down this corridor, maybe? I feel like I came through here. Open doors usually mean you came through here at one point. Yeah, I definitely went this way. Okay, what about the other direction? And there's not like a little... You see the teeny tiny there in the bottom corner? Um, the compass? Useless. Why didn't they make a mini-map? Who just has a compass? Yay, I know I'm going north, and that's all I know. Oh, there's the marketplace. Ooh, shiny. I mean, yeah, it's like, useful on, uh, was that? It's useful on Skyrim. Talk. Lousy common. Lousy and common. Oh, goody. Wow. Just what I need with my stuff. So here's our little marketplace where you can usually find an NPC the to give you some... The day is here. The day is here, yes. Find an NPC to give you a random quest that you cannot currently complete because... Says it's good to meet a fellow Yin Jagni cousin. Keep hoarding things the way you should. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I am all for hoarding. Oh, wrong button. This gives me the um, points for my psionic abilities. I have not yet. Come on, I just need one more opportunity to be an asshole. That's, that's it. All right, what do you want? Says everything's changing in these dark coming days. Nothing stays the same. Oh, it's gonna get dark. Not even houses. Have you heard of Chubza? Such a wild wanderer. Even his hut moves. Like howls moving castle? But he'd have a lot to talk about with a Roma like you. Where can I find Chubza? Says they've seen him in many different places. Impossible to tell. That's so helpful to me. Says Chubza isn't the sort to wait in one place for you. Oh, excuse me. Does he know who I am? You just got to watch for Chubza and his mobile hut. A moving home sounds useful. Says that's true, even if Chubza might not share it. 
Well, you see where this is going. Chubza is gonna get the smackdown. Where, how far off is Chubza? Oof, 2,640 units of distance. I'm to ride either your devilish goat or the not weird, ugly black sure thing that, that looks like so it can stare at your soul. Which is where you get weapons. Check out the wares. Confident you'll find everything you need here. Do you even have money or leaves? I don't think I have enough money, but I like to look anyway. Says you came to the right place. They own mm. you. Only stock the finest. Right, 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 right. There's a toe cutter, a scrap rack, a two dent, two dent, and a clip cut. Okay, they just have parts, and then I can sell my stuff. You are useless. Oh, I can see. I already own one of these guys, the, the cutie here. <laughs> Nico, leave him alone. Oh, that that lagged a little bit. Okay, here's where you buy clothes. You'll notice that this character, this look at look at the face. Are you ready? Look at this. All right, he looks like he's from Kiss, first of all. And then if I come back over here and look at this merchant, right, about the same. And if I come over here and look at this merchant, she turn her ass around. I'm sorry, I'm gendering you because you're pink, but, um, exact same face. Like, for some reason, all the merchant characters look the same. Yeah, look exactly the same. And then they'll often say the same thing, like, you'll go to one stall, be like, oh, you're in luck, there's usually a line here. And then you'll go to the next stall, you're in luck, there's usually a line here. I'm like, where? Where is there <laughs> enough people, or rodents, I don't, what, animals? to create a line. Please show me where you were hiding your extra midgers. Peddler is eager for you to have a look at the wares. Hmm. The right place. See, the only, the only stock products of the finest quality. That sounds exactly like the stall I just came from that had absolutely nothing for me. Yeah. Oh, I like this. I can't see someone just, okay, thank you. A uh, leather frock. It has there's better. a line in their dreams. Exactly. <laughs> and that's where everything else is located. Like, what are you talking about? I really like this outfit. I... Mm -mm. I do not have it even close. I know you can't... Well, you can probably see my money a tiny bit through me. I have 680 leaves to my name. Where do I store all these leaves? I don't know. In like a coin purse? Like it's a, Probably it's a little thing I unzip and it's just like this page, like a binder <laughs> of leaves. Why leaves? You could have picked up anything else. Any... Sir? I, I wanted to crouch but I can't. Sir, mm -hmm. are you being punished? What? N Nico, look, look at this. Where's the rest of him? Um, he looks so angry. In the ground? Oh hey my goat! Uh, Alright, we're gonna, we're we gonna head out. Stop breaking the world and come dig the Netra drums instead. Um, what? Okay, yes. Let's, um, I'm not gonna go to the doing that side quest. It doesn't tell you when you pick up quests, like a recommended level or, or, I don't know, attack power amount, but usually if it's this far away from you, you gotta travel across all these quadrants. Uh, it's not doable at the current time. So I've, I've, I've done one side quest, or I've attempted one side quest, got badly beaten and licked my wounds and came back to the main quest. I'm sure once they eventually send me over there, you know, organically, then yes, I'll do that. So these are the tribes available to you. They all used to be disciples of the one true master of Wong Fu, which happened to be your mother because conveniences make stories. Yeah the the jagni and their their leaning is dark now you can get even even darker if you join lotus lotus is maximum darkness and he he looks like what i think americans at war look like but he's got shurikens as his tribe thing so as soon as i get enough darkness i'm kicking jagni to the curb like hey you know how i claimed all this land for you it's mine hmm. but there's <laughs> the Ankadi, which are light these are never gonna Never gonna vibe with me again. <clears throat> they're they're really not a fan of me. Netra, which looks like a grappling hook. The the item next to them are their tribe weapons. You can only get them by either subjugating that tribe, which means oh well, I'll have access to them. Subjugating that tribe completely, which means I'll get his boomerang. I don't know what that is. Or um, actually allying with them. So my current ally, the Jagni, is I've already gotten it. And here are the current mammals I have. They're all gnotes, and... They're what? Gnote. 
G N O A T. It's like goat with an N. Note. Note? Moat? Boat? I still like him. Hilarious. He looks like something out of Spirited Away. Like, you have to ride this creature to get to where you're going. Will it bite? Probably. Keep your hands to yourself. Main. Whoa. That's. That's in the exact Don't direction I came from. It's not your friend. He is my friend. Look at him. I can fast travel. Sorry, I'm going to abandon you. Note. Let's see. So if you use these thingies, I can go back this way. Uh, damn, I haven't gone here yet. I can go back here. Yes. Okay, so that's close enough. I like how these rival tribes are like right across from each other, like the Hatfields and the McCoys. We just wake up every morning, we shoot at each other and hope that, hope with all our might that one of us will die. One or the other. I don't lean either way. I'm just here to watch the world burn, okay? I've decided, because usually in, in games, I, I'm too nice. Like, I feel so bad <laughs> mm. about making mm -hmm. <clears throat> the wrong decision. So this time around, I'm like, you know, this is new. This, is, this has been a fun time so far. I'm gonna go ahead and like fuck everything up. I just called my, oh wow, that was quick. Good service. And now it's raining, so I'm going to be super wet. Was that him? What a weird noise, yeah. kind of a large beast. So we're gonna go over here. I'm going to actually save because I haven't done that and that makes me nervous. Uh, I doubt. Nothing Nothing becomes of you if you, oh, he fell. If you die, it'll just ask if you'd like to save from the most recent. What the hell is that? Hi, hello. Um. It's like a beaver. It's like the race you are, but not, you know, civilized. Like, it's, it's beast on beast violence. Like, you can't feel too badly about that. I guess that's some of why I'm like, yeah, fuck you, I'm not gonna be nice to you. Like, they're weird little raccoon dog animals. Like, what? And yes, yes, every life is precious and they deserve someone to hear of their plight, but... Oh, this is where I went the first time. After the tutorial, they're like, here's your first decision. You need to act either take this road over the over the you know, this broken ass highway over there or go through the woods. I was like, I'm not walking through the woods. What kind of nonsense is that? I just saw a monster go that way. What the hell but you're is wrong supposed with to go after the monster. That natural tunnels like this still exist. Most of them got flooded. Oh nice. It did shield me from the rain very briefly. We'll look out for more. No um, one's going to see you coming in the dark. Huzzah! I don't know if that's a actually... strange thing to say. I mean, maybe if we're fighting, maybe he's referring to. This will be a sneak attack. What a lovely night. Ooh. <laughs> what a lovely night. Crash. Fortunately, there's no damage here. Still a better driver than Nico. This area was beautiful hmm. before the tribe war began. Look at it now. It's a war zone. I don't know, random ruts don't really scream war zone to me. Like, sure, maybe something went on here, but it's still pretty. There's still, oh, there's nothing in here. Fire upon you. It's still pretty. Wow. We have Is the it? moon and the tree. Ooh, yes. I always check. Anytime I go through these little ruts. Health pack, I probably need that. Let's be honest. Any other thingamajigs? There are these little pockets. There might be something for me to smack open. No. No? Nope. Okay. Where's my note? There he is. He's so loyal. I like him. I had to actually buy this one, unfortunately, but, you know, worth. I really like mounts in games, period. Any sort of familiar. Anyone you can take with you to feel less like you're alone in this world. Not the narrator, though. He sucks. Like, why are crickets? That's really rude. There's other skins for him. I'd like to discover one, and hopefully they're not just, like, little bugs. What is, is that my fighting That's force? the Myriad Tribe's force. Oh. Will they be friends or foe? You should head out there. That way you'll know. Clearly foe. We brought an army to fight the... What kind of bullshit? Will they be friend or foe while you mount this attack against them? Well, gee, I don't know. Most people don't enjoy getting attacked. Just a, just a side note, narrator, in case you're ever trying to make friends in the future. Oh, pee on a stick. I'm an animal, what can I say? 
That part's also ridiculous to me. Let's like, let me see. just pee my radioactive urine onto this post so that I can see where the hell I am. What? What even is that? Like a lion with a hat? What am I looking at? Uh, that little... looks like Dr. Seuss. <laughs> <laughs> oh. like the Grinch. <laughs> the cat in the hat. Wait, this is mine? What even is that? It's a very fat cat with like a... It looks like if a moogle swallowed a, a behemoth, and then they kind of feed. Oh, these are horrible. Yeah. All right, these are hand drawn. What, 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 what can you do? These animals are too left into the oncoming light. Okay. Anyway, don't get your hopes up. You see this big guy here? What he does is he's a battering ram. So he, you know, gets you in there. And then abandons you. So it's like, yeah, you'd be, you look like you'd be really good at fighting. This is the tribe's last stand. Conquer this fort, and that'll be the last of the resistance. The tribe will be under your command. Okay, now when you say my command, you mean literally like my command? Like this is mine now? I don't share. He says you'd better be. The you better be ready. To fling you over the wall with a sling lobber. However, he wants you to secure a hard hat first, should anything go mm. wrong. He's really safety first. We are invading an enemy capital. I need you to go out and purchase a hat to protect your head. Yeah, Maybe you go and find no. one for yourself. It Rest can't be too count. much trouble, though. It's one size fits all. The sling lobber fling. Hilarious. Let's trot on over here. Secure a hard hat. Can I? It's a beaten path to that door. If you go there, you'd better make an entrance. Do, do, do I need the hard hat even? Like, it's pointing me that way. I just knock, knock. Hey, um, hi. I need a hard hat. No, I can't actually get in here. Well, fuck. Where do I get a hard hat? <laughs> I like, how, I like how I asked him, and he, the Shisu, in all of his everlasting knowledge, was like, it's best if you find one yourself. Like, just, just fucking do it. You, you got this. We believe in you. Oh, it's down here. I'm a firm believer in, in, in people helping themselves, you know? Hey, fuck off. He just slapped me with a gun. That's real rude. I will parry one of these days, guys. One of, one of the- there we go. I don't know if you heard the clank, but then of course the asshole with the gun is just- Who <laughs> stand against that? No one, it's the unstoppable pig. I'm ignoring you. Cause there's no need for me to even look at you, like, fuck you. Yeah, how does that feel? You like to shoot guns? I've got a gun too. Out of ammo, but you know. I got it. Do you? <laughs> I like the slow-mo at the end, like, you've done so much! Like, it was two little raccoon dudes, it's, it's okay. Is this the direction I came from? See, this is where a mini-map would be so useful. I know I didn't cross any water, water's scary. Bad water. But there might be some sort of resources out this way. Yeah, the game's real pretty. I, I imagine it looks even better on, like, a PS4 Pro or a PS5, because, you know, they've got all the hardware and technology to make your eyes bleed out of your skull. I'm not wow. there yet. We'll, <laughs> we'll eventually upgrade, but for now, this is... My, I, I love my PS4. I will continue to love my PS4. How did the music change? What are we... And can we talk? Can we talk real quick? Ooh, is there something behind there? Oh god, I'll drown. Is it? Mm -mm. It's worth the risk. That's the myriad for... Oh, no. I like how that, that registered as me seeing the location. Now, you will drown if you try to swim. You'll notice my, my key meter is also used for swimming for some reason, and like he swims like a fucking pinwheel. Look at it. In, in what world does an animal swim like- wouldn't a doggy paddle make more sense? Like if I can run on all fours, I can also doggy paddle. Human beings can doggy paddle. It's like the first way you swimming learn how to swim. Ridiculous. Gotta say, I like the style of the game. Me too. I, I, I mean, I'm. I have found no fault in it. I've. Uh, Nico read a review to me because I'm lazy. <laughs> Nico read a review mentioning how um, he had played for however many. It was a a critic 
Um, he had played for how many hours and the game had crashed all of like nine, ten times. I haven't had a single crash. Like I mentioned, I'm at this point five, over five hours in and nothing has crashed. It, it works fine. It looks spot. fine. It's a place for rent. No. Um, like, it's not going to be anyone's game of the year, I think. It, it, it doesn't do anything that will shock and awe you. Smoking three. Heat. Um, quit. Okay, yeah, so this is one of the mods, like Nico mentioned. After I fire all the bullets in this tiny gun, it's gone. Days like, what? wasting. Get to work while you can. Leave me alone. I'm busy. Looting. They're not gonna go anywhere. It's a fortress. You don't leave the fortress. You hold yourself up and hold out against enemy attack. That may or may not be coming today. We'll see. <laughs> Depends on how I'm feeling. Anywho, I should probably go back around. This place is large. Large and empty. But yeah, like, the world doesn't feel full. I understand it's the apocalypse, but, like, shouldn't there be... or post-apocalypse? I mean, technically we're in the middle of apocalypse. I mean, yeah. if a creature's trying to eat your planet, then you're in an apocalypse. I hate to break it to you. Like, don't think anything else of it. There's no fall damage, by the way, so if you just want to fall off and slap into things, that's fine, too. Which I like. I, I don't slap like... Into just slap into things? Just smack. I don't like fall damage in, in open world RPGs, I don't. Because uh, I don't want to be standing at the top of a cliff and be like, how can I slowly glitch myself down like the rocks? It's not meant to be done like this, but I really don't feel like taking the, the 10 hundred in-game units of measurement to get down. How can I? No, not in this game. You just, just playing. Just whoop. Swoon. Oh, I guess I got my little little fire thing now. I like how the little cricket is just standing there. Like, I'll be here in the middle of your combat so I can... I've got the best view. I'm gonna comment on what you're doing. And that is my absolute... Yep, it's good. That is my absolute contribution to your life, sir. You got this? No, you got this. You're alone, but you got this. Not today. I do like too, I don't know if you just saw me flip over someone's head, but kind of like how Spider-Man, when you dodge people, you go over them. It would be helpful if I had some web slinging ability. That would be great. Like, where's that? What, what's that look like? The, oh, God damn it. Stuck in the tree. Um, what does that mutation look like? Just real quick. Can we talk? Like, it's not, it's not copyright. I could be spider, spider raccoon. I was gonna say spatter coon, that sounds mm. sounds so bad. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's not necessary. Oh, hello. It's kinda hard to see you when you're on fire. It's gonna be easier. Flash I gotta watch out for the guy behind me. Yeah, that guy. That one over there. The rude one. Oh, I have no energy. I was gonna I was gonna Bleh. poison. You're gonna what? Bleh. It's poison vomit, Nico. The the move actually says that you vomit poison. Thank you. Goodbye. So yeah, in, in, in lieu of actually like using the game mechanics that you're supposed to, you know, parrying and junk, I've just been flinging myself around. And it's worked out. It's worked out, I think. I haven't died. Knock on wood. I haven't died, so mm. that's, there's that. I think the only time I did die, I did, what was I doing? It was something funky, and it just all share the same destiny, destruction or survival. Oh, I guess I just had to one last fuck you. We're gonna take all your stuff before we subjugate you. Yeah, after you're out of combat, health heals up relatively quickly. So like, why even, why even heal? I'll be all right. Curve alloy. Will you? Quality Rick Rack three. I don't, know, I don't know what that means, but okay. This is a hard- it- this looks like the Kraken from, um, Final Fantasy VI Ultros! Am I gonna put that on my head? Return to Sifu? Uh, do, did I get something? Like what? I guess they'll show it in the cutscene when they fling me over the wall. Mm -hmm. Cryogenic module. Polar 5. Magazine size 24. Alright, so remind me not to shoot my weapon until I'm in there, okay? I don't want to waste this. I 
Is there someone here? What did the music do that? Hello? Yeah. They're gonna come flinging out of the trees. They don't do that. Sometimes you notice just something scuttling along on the ground. You're like, what the fu- Like the, the weird beaver thing. It's like, what is happening? What is that? Let me just do my, my diligence with a mammal and run down the road. Hmm. Loping around at the speed of sound. Just enjoying the countryside. It's a beautiful day. You know? A g great day to, to invade a people and just kind of, you know, wipe their existence off the face of the earth. Yeah. That's my every day. Alright, I got my silly helmet. I wonder which one I selected. You need Why to hit them where it flung? hurts. Inflict as much suffering as possible. Let the mayhem begin! I've just been, like, anything that could be considered dickish, I'm just been like, yeah, let's fuck it up. But punching people who are down. Yeah. You're the hammer on their nail. Oh, I have a regular... <laughs> Isn't that gonna do more damage to me? Yeah! Oh, he flung another person with me. Wow. You there made it. Go. Here comes the first wave. So most forts are, are kind of set the same way where you'll have waves of defenses you have to go through. Most of them- oh, it's frozen. Okay. Okay, where's my cryogenic powers at? Like, I'm bad at controlling this. Actually, this is this is what I meant to do. I, I meant to get away from them because there's so many of them and only one of me. That's I was I was separating. Okay, it was strategy, guys. Strategy, not me just accidentally flinging through something that I thought I couldn't go through. That's that's not what happened. Mm -hmm. And if you say otherwise, you are a cheat and a liar. Are they even burning at all? Something? Yeah, things like snarling. Okay, I should probably start parrying. If they're not gonna keep firing at me, like... Assholes, then... There, that was a parry. And then you lift them up and you slap them around a few times. So parrying is useful. It, it stuns the enemy and allows you to follow with a chain that can like broken. Now, that doesn't stop other enemies from firing at you, so... Bleh. Like, it, there's not like a moment of invulnerability where it's like, Haha, I've got you now! No, 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 no. They will continue to shoot their little pew pews at you. And they're actually called Pew Pew. There's a Pew Pew dealer. <laughs> because silly. So silly. That was another parry. And I'm getting shot at still, but you know. It is what it is. Like I said, the, the combat works. It feels uh it feels fluid. It's not gonna be anyone's game of the year. I promise you that. Pits feel solid enough. Yeah, the, and the weapons control differently. I want to build a two-hand weapon since I started with a uh, two... What, really? Really. I couldn't hit him because of the hay, really. Um, I started with a dual wield, so those two one-hand weapons. Um, I only used a two-hand weapon in like a dream. That's a weird sentence, but it's true. <laughs> so that felt different, but it was only for like two seconds. I couldn't comment on how solid and heavy that is. Gotta love games that don't take themselves seriously sometimes. Yeah, it, that was exactly what I said the other night. Biomutant does not take itself too seriously. I don't know if that's what they were going for when they named things ridiculous names, but it, it worked. Like, I can't... Daytime is a good time to be outside. Okay, yes, thank you. It is a good time to be... Wait, I just saw something. Shiny. Sorry, I will subjugate these people. I will end their lives. But first, what was that shiny thing? I can't even get over there, can I? Wow. <laughs> but first... Oh, invisible barrier. Just kidding, you can't do it anyway. <laughs> Here's our open world, don't go that way. <laughs> uh, but I am having a, a genuinely... A that name actually makes sense. I'm having a the genuinely good time with like Bamu. You just need to create a spark to light a fire. Two, um, this one down here. Three. It burns brighter than the light. Does it? Uh, mm, okay, yeah, sure. Mm. All right, now that's burning. Oh, like I said, I'm just here to watch the world burn. And here we go, another wave of enemies that look exactly the same as the enemies I just took care of. You're slowly wiping them out. Just slowly. I'm gonna go in here now. Thank you. Bye-bye. Treasure! No! 
I can't because I'm in a fight. Why do games do that? I mean, I know why games do that, but why do games do that? I'm just trying to loot some stuff, man. Like, I'm not asking for too much, I think. Okay. He blocked my parry. I don't understand. I just don't. That's what that little shield above its head was. Like, I tried to launch him and it was like, mm -mm, the deep not today. What are my other combos? Ooh! <laughs> These little kung fu pandas just all came at me at once. It's cute! They're cute. I can't. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, I have no ammo. Oh well, just, just, just stand in that. Just stand in that for a little bit. Oh, I didn't even mean to dodge him. I stepped out of the way and it still slowed down. That's pretty funny. But yeah, I like. I genuinely, when I was fighting that hoodie, hoodie Komodo dragon, I couldn't. I, I had to laugh. Like, what am I doing right now? And wait till you see the world eater. It's like a very fuzzy three-headed shark. It's an alarming looking thing. It's not alarming. It's weirdly cute. Nico doesn't... Uh, Nico wouldn't know what cute was if like Bella came over there and smacked her in the tail with a face rolled over and asked for belly rubs. Like that, that's... Mm. Bella who is currently ignoring her. Her humans. Wasn't there another guy? Oh no, we're, we're good. Oh, oh yes. We're good. We're all good. Good, all good. For now. How are you not dead? Oof. And then he smacks. Oh, that is the tribe weapon he has in his hands. That weird little... I'm trying to figure out what it is. Like, it's a boomerang, right? Look at it. Yeah, and it comes back to him. Very, very quickly. Oh, yeah. What? Huh. I want it. Wow. <laughs> the pyro sizzler. Let's get sizzled. I don't, I don't know. Um, you don't often, like there's a stat, I think it's luck, that you can sink points into that'll actually make it so that you'll loot enemies more often. You, you don't currently do that. Like every so... This won't be a field trip. It's the real thing. As a, what? A field trip? I'm sorry, is that what you call a practice run, Mr. Narrator? What? Oh, that was a cricket. Like, oh, I'm ready to fight. Oh, what's down here? What weird looking plants? Anything else to... And also, if this is a fortress, how did I run into two waves of enemies? Like, shouldn't there be soldiers teaming about just nah. waiting to fuck me up? No. Fuck me up, soldiers. Okay. <laughs> Nico, are you wiggling it? Yeah. Sounds worse than it actually is. Oh no, water, my enemy. And you'll notice too that the, the this is only one tribe that I've been to, but most That's of the places. Sizzler, right there. Oh, okay. What is it? Fire the pyro sizzler at the fort. Where? Oh. Nice crackle. Just get to work on it. Make it frizzle. Hmm. Make it frizzle. Yank the gate open. Oh, I guess I'm done with this. Alright, thank you, Pyro Sizzler. Any more... Yeah, like, where is... The, the distinct lack of anyone trying to stop anything... Anything trying to stop me from taking over their way of life is just... Uh, unless they're all, like, standing in this room for their, their last stand. It's like, why would you... It looks like it's strong enough to pull down a gate. But you Pulling. just need to aim straight, shoot and pull, and the gate will come down. The gate didn't even give the any resistance. No. Nope. ...on understanding of the greater good and a code of honor. They believe uniting the tribes is the only way to restore the peace. And I believe that you should die. Get out of Look at him, his little sultan hat. He was hoping it wouldn't end this way. There's no reason to fight instead of uniting. It would be fighting over nothing. I'm fighting for me. Wow. What the hell is that sound? Hope has abandoned you! He'll fight for whatever shred of hope he has left to unite the tribes and save the tree of life. Because all six tribes have their own agendas, of course. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a little boomerang. The rival Sifu. Oh, hey, I have friends. I'm not alone. A radiated defender. A little Kung Fu stance. Sir, 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 sir. 
So can I ignore them and fight him? That would be useful. Unless they come after you if your dudes die. Oh, I can- yeah, exactly. They can- you, they have health bars, so they can just smack your guys over and then- Oh, sorry, I thought you were an enemy. There's no friendly fire, but... I, I, for whatever reason, felt badly for trying to hit him. Like, you're fine, dude. Walk it off! Oh, I should be- I should be using my tribe weapon, right? Tribe weapon against tribe weapons and sort of beautiful poetic justice to it. Oh, mm -mm. That little, uh, wrong one. Yeah, I'm paying attention. Oh, hmm, hmm. Odd. Why isn't my tribe weapon on the hot bar? Oh, uh, the little, uh. Oh, this is on fire! I told you, I've never used the actual. this weapon. I like it! Okay, well, I'm gonna use you more often. You're a good time. It's like the, uh, Cestus is from. I think it's Cestus from God of War, you know, the giant ass, the third game, uh, the giant ass fist that just felt really great to, I don't know, rip dogs in two. Again, uh, weird sentence. Shush. <laughs> weird sentence, but if you play God of War 3, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So don't even. He keeps, he keeps doing that, where I have to dodge out of the way. He has an AOE, Nico. His wow. arms are amazing. What even am I doing with my life right now? We're fighting a seafood. 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 Mm. Delicious. I'm just gonna create a mess here. He's almost dead. Bam. That oh. was easy enough. Yeah. Tribe Fort conquered. Woo! The first of... What, five? five? Yeah, because yeah. I'm with them. The rival Sifu is defeated, and the destiny of their tribe is in your hands. Or in one giant glove. <laughs> you are free to choose their fate, but not mm -mm. free from the consequences of your choice. Yes, I can be a dick! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Only time I'm happy about you that. leave it mm. up to you to decide the fate of the rival Sifu, but you either stay true to the cause, or not loyal at all. It's black and white. And you know that is a good hmm. th that is a good point. Any of the choices you make in here, there's no there's no like questioning like, oh well, it's a little light and a little dark. It's either gas or like pure as snow. Like there's no The neat thing is though, is that the certain characters will comment on your past or something and bring up something that you've done, which I thought was kind of interesting. Yeah, I'm not sure if we'll have one of them, but um part of the game is that you remember yourself as a child. And by doing so, you go back in time and you're able to do different actions. And when you return to the present, people will remember you for those actions that you, you as a player, did as a child. I'm killing this bitch. Did as a child. So it kind of, Ending it also you changes your standing. Ending forget the hard fate that has been put upon him. This punishment is justice for the unjust. Oh, really? And with Word? that, you're spinning your own fate. Oh my, there it goes. Never to be undone. Well, not confused. One by one, they'll fall until everything is brought into subjection. Was that good or bad? He wants you to focus. These are the new rival outposts your tribe needs to take control of. Quark. What? Quarp. Rock a block. <laughs> Let's go to Corp Quark first. He says you'll mm -hmm. regret not being Metro. on their side. So the only is. way you learn their secrets, Wung Fu and the tribe weapon now, is if you defeat him. And that will never happen. That'll never happen. That's what the last guy said. He's dead. Oh, hey, we already Your gutted Sifu this place. Is pleased. Your help sealed victory and the destiny of the rival tribe. My help? I did it all. Who the hell were you during the fight? But he's still Chillin'? eager to seal the fate of the world. It's just a matter of time before the tree will fall. Fate of the world? Fate is never fair, and it loves the fearless. It's your duty to make one thing happen instead of another. What leads to what and what destroys what? What? You've grown so much stronger than when you first met. Nine whole levels. And now, <laughs> the tribe relies on your strength to take on the remaining rivals. I was never weak. He mm -hmm. meant that everything that has happened to you has only made you stronger. I will bathe in the blood of my enemies. It's a lot of enemies. Yeah, it's a lot of blood. That's a good-ass bath. 
Claim the rival tribe weapon. Oh, okay. I get the little boomerang now. I'm keeping this fist. I'm just saying. Like, th this is mine. I didn't know it had fire. Wow. I like how his entire being is just, I'm gonna sit on thrones in different in a variety of places. Like, this is... Do I have any Wong Fu? Yes. Do I have any Wong Fu mm -hmm. I can... Like, this. All of this was already... Already unlocked when I got to it. There were maybe two or three things that I added to it, so I'm not 100% sure. There it is. Old World Clonk Fest. Oh, I did learn it. Copper Touch. Shoot, shoot. Huh. Don't flinch away from this. It's your moment. You need to focus. You need to focus. Wow. Oh! You shoot the fist! That's neat. Hmm. I'm keeping this one. It's the Myriad Boomerang. That's such a weird tribe weapon. I mean, it seemed useful when he was using it, but... Much like Pokemon, it's like, oh wow, this is a great Pokemon, then you get it. And it's like, what happened to all the moves it just used against me? What? Yeah. Yeah, that, that's how they get you. Okay, so we we conquered a tribe, guys. We did a thing. Do I feel like I did a thing? No. <laughs> I had fun. <laughs> I don't know, it, it wasn't like a... It didn't feel like a, a life or death struggle, you know? It didn't feel like I'm changing what's happening. But this this is my first ever... Uh, tribe... Conquering, Conquer, so yeah. I don't... I didn't even get to change my aura. Did it even matter what I did to him? And that too, like, does it even matter? I'm just gonna, wait, should I check the store? Did they? I didn't see them bring in, like, the usual platoon. I don't know if they... I don't know if they just gave this place the old paint job and moved on with their lives. Are those? Oh. I thought there was were more of those silly helmets. I mean, my tribe's got style. Look at this. They look like an ancient shogunate. Yeah. Or whatever you call... The people serving you can under only a really uh, appreciate them if you're you're a horrible person. So you know, you don't have to be horrible. They're they're the least dark of the dark side. Like they're I'm I'm going I'm going all the way. What? How? Like he looked kind of hard until you saw the hand. You're like, what's going on with you, sir? So. Shudders to think about how a kid became such a ruined adult. It's interesting that the narrator said adult, but on the screen it says groany, which I guess is the word for grown up. I mean, look at his hat. He looks like a kid. <laughs> oh, come on. You wouldn't you wouldn't rock that hat, Nico? No. You're absolutely no fun. Just none. Zero. I discovered a new weapon today. Whoop, whoop. Hello, hello. If you're just joining the stream, playing by a mutant. Just overthrew my first tribe and on to subjugate the next, I suppose. It doesn't look like there's anything else here. It sounds, here. you know, it's good times, good times. Okay, well, they're sending me kind this of far away. About you. Whether kind you of far away. Or fail, it's on you. Okay. Like, like I said, sometimes the narrator chimes in, you're like, okay, was well, there more to that? Like, what? Uh. They actually added, Nico's been following updates and whatnot, they added a, a bar where you can actually turn off how, or adjust how frequently the narrator chimes in with his nonsensicalness. So I, I turned it down a little bit, because before he was just, every so often, he was like, the power is within you. It's like, okay... With light comes dark. Alright, I'm buying a horse. I don't know why I need to know that. Uh, I'm sorry, a note, not a horse. There he is, my buddy. So I'm going to try, try, keyword, a um, a side quest, <laughs> something that's hopefully closer than whatever is going on all the way up here. Because now all of this land is my own. I shouldn't be attacked by random, random, Animals. Okay, this is. Find the sludge trucks. Where's. Ooh, that's far. Find the fry sparkers. That's an ongoing one, ongoing one, ongoing one. Flush stools. That, by the way, is a toilet. Why that am I looking for toilets? Awful. Oh, uh, oh, what about the strong box, Nico? We can find a strong box. Oh, that's far. God damn it. <laughs> that is ultimately what decides. Well, it's still. 
close to where I need to be. Nupstonies. Mm. All right, let's head to the Nupstonies. Like, can I teleport anywhere? No, this is this is as far as the eye has gone. Okay, so I'll just give it the old go. There's a lot of water over here, which is unfortunate and not going to happen. Oh, mm, there was this dish. I had been over here, but I wasn't able to actually like hurt anything. I'll I'll try that one. You're on a mount. And? God. You're here <sighs> for a reason. It's up to you to figure out what that is. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a little cricket. Just he's on the ground and what he does is talk to you. That's that's his whole entire existence. It's odd, but whatever. Hydrate. It was a hot day. Yeah, it rained for like two seconds. Drink water, it's good for you. PSA. Cutscenes, though un infrequent, are a little, a little long. <laughs> Not Cozy Grove long, mind you, but eh, could be shorter. But it is fast travel, so it gets a pass. All right, so let's find a strong box. Um, no, that's not what I'm doing here. I'm going here. I was supposed to find something. Um, can I mark it or is it too... No, it has to be an actual location to mark it. Damn. All right, I'll, I'll remember. I just need to go across the water, right? Over here. Hmm, okay. I'm not going across that water. That is disgusting. We'll go around. Yes, this is the Domp outpost. I'll assume they meant dump. Just gonna cut across here. Ugh. Did that say leaping lice? I have a move called leaping lice. That's. Wait. Do I have. No. Huh. I thought it would be the. Let's try the boomerang. Is it on my list of. It is not. Oh, there's the Jagley staff. Okay. Um, can I add it to. Because I should be able to use it now, that was the whole point of subjugating these people. No, it's... Huh. That's odd. Is it just for shell? Or is it a ranged weapon? Inventory. Ranged base types? No. Huh, that's weird. Why isn't it... Yeah, this, this. So you can change him, eventually. I'm not sure when but he might can... be able to find special Ooh. things that have a uh... nico you can fly she was hoping i'd get yeah. wings but that's not gonna happen but he can be a glider okay so you do get more useful that's good we want everyone to have a purpose around here <laughs> okay i need to be on the other side of this what? which means i'm facing the wrong direction because it's definitely water okay I'll just keep heading this way skirt around jump over no oh, however it takes to get where you need to go. The water's a lot cleaner here, but... You still can't stay in it very long. Yeah, it's a, it's a short swim. Ah, there it is. The satellite. There was, um... I guess I can switch to that quest. I might as well keep track of it. It's, uh... <laughs> get a gentle slurp. Oof. Mind monitor. There we go. And I'm assuming that's like a television or something. That's what that sounds like. Because they said it can think for you. I was like, hmm. That's weird. Yeah, leaping lice. That's the name of an attack. If I, if I double jump. Every open world game needs a glider. Yeah, right. The sky totally is agree. as bright as it's going to be. Unless you know, Sonic, you know, blast. Just yeah, they're just a, they're just a good destroys way to the entire planet in like a solar flare. You know, good way to get really blight. Yes, me. Yeah, I I'm saving. I remember I came here and I walked into that little opening that you just saw in front of me and like three enemies came out and just slapped me and it was like, mm-mm, no. Like, like slap for real? I'm not, or just... I'm not ready for this. It is not my time. And that little cannon over there shot at me and it wasn't fun. But you can... Yeah, slap back at it. You're good. Okay, so that, that solves one problem. Ooh, that's a big boy. Well, that solves one problem. Yeah, 13. I'm like, what? But there doesn't seem to be... I'm level 10? I'm level 10, right? 
I'm somewhere there's about. There doesn't seem to be like a, like I said, there's no recommended. He's level six. How did we go from that to this? No recommended level. I want to switch. 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 Yes. What? What the hell? Um, oh, it's an EMP. Oh, oh, he can freeze himself. That's stupid. Oh. Why? The, um... Great, he can blow me up at any time. I was right, it is a... a ranged weapon. The, that's what I'm using now, is the Sifu that I just defeated. Who is dead now? I'm surprised there wasn't like any sort of cutscene where they were like, Haha, now we've killed you. You guys can stand in that, please. Please? Please stand near it? Near it. No? Fuck. So went to Wonderland. Ooh, that just sounds good. <laughs> it's a good time! I like these, I do. I really do. Does that thing explode? Oh yeah, yeah it does. Oops. Yeah, that yeah, might be good to stay away from yeah. that. I'm fine. Right. Same as last words, I'm fine. Nice! I'm all about that base. Wham! Oh, he's dead. I don't know why I'm continuing to... But... There's no cancel either, this isn't a fighting game. It's like, I'm in the middle of this combo, let me cancel it. No, it's not just like, hit and slam. Roasted. Defeat him! Or finish him, rather. I don't know, I, I don't like the boomerang when compared to a gun. Like, they're not, they're not quite the yeah, same. Yeah, they're not mean. It's, one it can stun the, you, maybe. It doesn't have the... What you doing? Stop it! The oomph that a gun would. I should move. He's coming up on me. Yeah. See? So, so, run, squash, and repeat. What you do is you run into this, um, this little combat situation here, and you have these silly, silly little ones that are gonna be trying to. Oh, trying to shoot at you. Meanwhile, the big one will be just generally jumping at you. Like, that's, that's what has happened here. Is, He's using a toilet as a weapon, I just noticed. That's horrid. I mean, it's use like it, you gotta... No! It's like a mace, I guess. Would, don't you consider that? Copper touch. Bad touch! Oh, now I'm level 10. Okay, just kidding. Just hit 10. <laughs> We're doing well. We're doing fine. Everything's fine. Leaping lice! Leaping little Oh, he sounds sad! Oh, oh no. See, and this is why I don't get near... There we go. So this is um this is your super wong fu, which is really just any any sort of he is in the ground. Any sort of like super mode that you usually find in open worlds, like uh, whatever you want to call it. Um, I can't think of one right now. Like an open world where you ha you're able to use more power than you normally do. Anything uh. that comes to your mind when I just said that. Yes, that. Um, and it's very short-lived, but you, you're you super strong in the two seconds it lasts. It's, it's called Super Wong Fu that you use, so that's what I did. I just crammed him into the ground and he's completely gone. All right. How interesting. I'm not sure if that was supposed to- he didn't come back out either, like, he's, he's gone. <laughs> There's no body. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's how that was supposed to go, but... Find the mind monitor. Okay. And this, the mind monitor, might bring us to a another kind of uh, teeth grindy thing that I have about Biomutant. There, there aren't a whole lot of them, but this was... Hmm. Where am I going? Oh, hey! Resources! I'll take that. Looks like rubber? Just check that skronk out. Stronk. What? I don't know. What? What is a skronk? Stronk. Claw bar is too weak to bust this open. You need to upgrade it at pebbles. Oh, okay. I'll do that. Priorita prioritizing pebble. Find a pebble to strongen your claw hmm. bar. Oh, let's get strong, guys. I'll find pebble. I'm not even sure who pebble is, to be honest. There's a thing down here. What is it? I keep hearing snarling. That's and I'm a not... mind ah. monitor from the days gone. A device it's... that blip screened smart matter. Wouldn't be surprised if it still works. What? It still works. There's not even a plug for it to. This is a very old computer too. That's not what I was expecting. Like there's no look tough cap. 
there, there's no explanation as to like what period of time this was set in so some of the stuff you'll see you'll be like okay so this was like the 1980s and then the world exploded before 2000 like what <laughs> Looks like the inputters need to be linked to get the mind monitor to boot up. So here's what I was talking about. Puzzles in this game, they're all the same. It doesn't matter what it's on. It doesn't matter if it's on a washing machine, doesn't matter if it's on a toilet, doesn't matter, weird sentence, doesn't matter if it's on a, a, a refrigerator, they're all the same. What you need to do is rotate these little knobs so that the same colors touch each other. Easy, yes. There's been a case where it brought me to the puzzle, and you, you see I have moves left, so they're they're limited, and you get more moves if you sink more points into intelligence. Another point. Point is, at one point I, I went into one of these puzzles, and it was already solved. Like, it, it was correctly inputted, so I'm looking at it, and I'm like, do I... So I tried. I rotated it once, one way, and back the other way, and they're like, you did a good job! I'm like, seriously? <laughs> Fucking seriously? <laughs> Uh, like you have to be some sort of just a few moves left. Make them count. like they didn't even try. Like they just put these in here. Some just sort to... of mentally deficient to be unable to do these. Yeah. Software. I guess they just added way. puzzles just Success for the sake of puzzles. Of like that doesn't make any sense to me. Don't fucking add it if it's if it's gonna offend me. Like but really? Again, I'm six-ish hours in at this point, so we'll see if maybe they get harder. Bird. <laughs> no, come back! I don't understand how you catch those. It says interact and it never lets me catch them. What if you, you hit him with a boomerang? No, it says to, what? It says triangle. Uh, maybe you're not supposed to use that. It says triangle. Maybe there's what something else. To well, use it? Maybe you're. The fuck is your game gonna tell me to use a button and then be like, just kidding? It's not the right input. I Ow. mean, I mean, maybe it's not a net. Maybe there's something specific. I have a net. That's all I have. Just to catch uh, weird dancing boxes. Okay, maybe that's not <laughs> what you need to catch birds. Box. Okay, I'd like to go talk to Pebble. I'm not sure who Pebble is, but if he can strongen things for me, then I'm all for it. Hmm. Uh, yeah, intellect gives you power. More actually doesn't. Oh yeah, stat details. Okay. Mm -hmm. They, they give you a breakdown of everything you need to know. Super handy. You'll notice that none of these say, like, I don't know, more bullets or bullet damage or anything like that. Even though you use a lot of, um, defines the amount of moves you can perform, yeah. I notice how much key energy you have and how fast it regenerates, but it doesn't say it makes my, my useless powers a little more... I'm gonna damage you. Aha! The power stat. It, there's not a power... Oh, it's under intellect. Okay, so I definitely need more You're intellect. Grown wiser. Ah! <laughs> Cute. I I need to raise my aura. I would like a new move. I, I have all the points for a new what move. Was that? that was the cricket, I think. <laughs> I have all the points for a new move, but no ability to learn said new move. I think I'm moving too quickly. I want the bird. What? Nico, do you see that? The interact. What is that? Uh, <laughs> I don't think it's supposed to be there. What is that? Like a little horse? It looks like a what? dog. What is I that? I can't actually. There's one behind me. I got it. Nice. Choose the creature's fate. Oh, wow. What? Pet and keep creature. Keep creature. Kill creature. Is this gonna make me dark? I don't know. I've actually never seen pet oh. and keep it. See what happens. I want it, but I don't want to be light. What if I just keep it? What the hell was that? Is it in your inventory? And why is that one just floating there? I don't know! <laughs> Can I get it? It's too far for the actual yeah. net. It's too far from the net. If you jump, you're probably just gonna fall. Can I... Ugh! What?! Grim said what the... I can't even... What is that? I don't know. It may have. That's the it's same got one in a your inventory. Green face. Okay, is it in my inventory? Yeah, what do you even do with them? I think that one's stuck. It says gear. You have a little star. I don't mean anything. It's under like miscellaneous. No. Yeah, like here's my fruta squeezo and my naster bread. Muma of pearl. Duct tape. You know, for a fun time. Which is the only normal thing there. <laughs> in comparison to everything else. I. I'm- I don't know. I don't know what that was. It just added it to 
somewhere. I don't know. I don't there was no explanation either. The narrator isn't actually helping this time. He didn't actually say anything. It was just, would you like to keep this or kill it? Like, um, I don't know. What is it? What's it going to do for me? What have you done for me lately? Okay, well, that... I was caught weird. That. I couldn't catch the fucking bird, but I caught whatever that was. <laughs> <laughs> weird horse <laughs> caught in midair. Speaking of horses, I have I have one. I do. I should. I don't know. It doesn't feel much like I'm I'm trotting here, right? On all fours, like an, an animal tends to. And I don't know if the mounts are faster. Like, it doesn't feel faster, which is important. I mean, sure, it might be faster, but clam. Hello? Uh, really? I have to stand on this side? Yeah, because that's the side that's Another open. master bread. Master Those bread. Are just for selling. All right, I'll, I'll call the... I keep thinking that R2 does something and it does nothing. Where are you, buddy? Oh, goodness. He always comes from behind me. How the Ugh. fuck? There's water. At least his face is normal. Look how majestic he is. He ripples. Yeah. For a beastie, you know, this mount is so gentle. He's beautiful. Love him. Um, you're your right. personality. They, they do look like, excuse me, <laughs> majestic and somewhat terrifying. Yes, that does fit my personality, Nico. Thank you. How kind of you to say. I, mm, it occurs to me that I left some shit behind, but... Uh, did you hear that? Uh, yeah, it sounded big. It sounded very big. No, it's... It's, like it's a little, an enemy. It's a frog. It's a frog. He's, he's ready for fisticuffs. Yeah, he's he's got. Oh, oh there's, there's another, another one. one. There's another huggle. one. Huggle. Who's Huggle? Which one's Huggle? What is that? Oh my goodness! What is that? There, that is Huggle. He's a lazard. Oh no! Oh god! <laughs> I need to get off the horse. I can't fight. All right, Huggle, bring it on. The name. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> He, he rolls like the Radabon from Monster Hunter. Oh, he does! Look at his he face! He has no face! No! No face at all! No face, no problem! Yeah, I dodged you, man! I was in the air! What you want? You better watch out, he's gonna roll on you again. <laughs> That is the most alarming looking thing. It's like they've no, just it's forgot not. The, Bring like, back my friend the hoodie the hoodie lizard. Like they, they just forgot to add a snout and just like this slap they a mouth. They should have put a hoodie on him. Why is there no hoodie on this one? That one needs a hoodie. Onesies. That would be great. Oh, oh no. Oh we're fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> famous last oh. words. They're my famous last words. And famous they shall be. Everything is fine. Is it? Everything is awesome. Oh wait, what? I'm sorry, does my boomerang have ammunition? How is that? How do you even keep track of that? You can only fling it five times before your wrist gets too tired. Like how, what, what is the distinction there? Wait, I have a, I have a move. I have a move. I, I'll remember it in just a moment. Um, is it square circle thought? Oh, mm. wow. You, um, <laughs> okay. I have a move. Or maybe it's circle square thought. Oh, Komodo, Komodo stretch. stretch. Oh, I did the move. I did. I did. Yeah, that, that was my thing. That was my you one thing. You might want to watch your health, because, you know. <gasps> what? <laughs> Huggle, no! <laughs> oh, look I, at it. It's I face. Can. How do you take this seriously? Look at it. Look how fluffy. The name doesn't even sound scary. Look how fluffy and just ugly. Oh. But again, like I said, I, I don't tend to do fisticuffs with these things because it just continues to thrash. Like there's no throwing it off off track so that it's no longer spinning and clawing and like there's no downtime. Like this guy does not skip a day at the gym. Do you feel like there are certain instances where certain weapons would be more useful than the other? Like Monster Hunter, for example, you use certain weapons for certain monsters. Um, no, I have not felt that way. It's it's pretty much down to preference. Like, do you like shooting fire out of fists? Then use the fist thing. Do you like the do you like this current boomerang? I do not. I do not. Mm, I'm look switching. at it. Could you imagine that just know, stalking that just you in the middle better. of the night? See see how much better that feels? I mean, I know you guys can't feel what I feel, but just imagine briefly that what you had was like, I don't know, something from the Rinking tink uh, middle ages and then what you pulled out was like a nuclear launcher afterwards. That's how this oops. Just better. Just 
Oh. I can't! Puzzle down! There you go. Good job. Puzzle count. And again, do I Ooh. feel like I was... Do Dainty. I feel like I was fighting for my life? <laughs> I was laughing at Huggle. Can we, can we get another look at... I'm gonna take a picture with Huggle. Life is a difficult game, no matter how you play it. Oh, oh no. Ugh. The Not other one was I'm, far more difficult. I'm taking screenshots, guys. Just just bear with me. Oh, wait. Is it going to show the... Huh. That's a good question. I'll take the screenshot and worry about that later. Rest in peace, Huggle. <laughs> we'll, we'll see you in the next life. Oh, wow. That, that fucked all the way up. Okay. Ew, that thing of oh look at it! Look how they lay down. How is that not cute? That is not cute. Look the faces this. are horrifying. Look how they lay down. That is cute. Ignore the face. Just, just put. You can't. Yeah, just put look a at hand it. over. Ooh. <laughs> it's like a furry finger with a face. Oh, Nico, you have no joy in your heart. That's your problem. I don't. I don't have any joy. That that is your problem. And I'm perfectly fine being joyless. Huh, what's this? Don't mind if I do. You're just stealing. Ronin top. Is it better? No, it's definitely... It's lousy. A lot of things are lousy <laughs> in this world. You can upgrade them, so I guess it's just a matter of eventually I'll find the right parts and then, then I'll be able to look good and also be strong. Like bull or like a huggle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna strong it in things. Not like huggle. What, what was the name of that lizard in the onesie anyway? What I, was his name? I don't remember. I don't remember either. And you think it would have made a lasting impression on me? It was a fucking Komodo dragon in a bear onesie. Its name was probably ridiculous, which is why we don't remember. Bobas Knarfs. What? 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 Oh, oh goodness. God! What? It knocked the horse over. Bobas Knarfs, you are rude. Coming after you. What am I looking at? Some kind of troll? Look at this, his face! This looks like something from Miyazaki. You know those little uh, wood sprites or whatever you want to call them? It looks like that if it was on steroids and then left to mutate is what I'm seeing here. Does it have a face? It looks like someone drew it on with Sharpie. No, it has it has a mask. It has two eyes. And it burrows. Oh, yeah. Hmm, maybe you might want to watch out. <laughs> maybe you should not stand there. Don't attack my gnome. Oh, hey, what's that? I caught it! Nice. But, 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 I guess the monster ran away. Kill it. See what happens. Um, but what if I need them? I don't know. Okay. You don't even know where you store them. I don't even know what that was. It looks kind of like a fight. Wow, the, the fight stopped. Yeah. That was it. <laughs> yeah, I did. Ah, god damn it. I hope his health didn't go back up. It, it did. did. It did. Damn. I mean, you're still at a higher level than but he is. But you'll notice, he's level 7, right? So you'd think he'd be weaker than me and it would be a little quicker to fell him? Not so much. No. I don't, I don't know why they even give enemies levels. Like, there's no, there's no power rating, there's no, uh... There's no recommended level, there's no, you know, how, uh... What's the game? This is a game where if an enemy is a levels above you, they're written in... I think I think Torchlight does it. Mm -hmm. um, if the enemy is a few levels uh, above you, it's the, the text for the name is a little... Uh, is a different color. That way you know, you know, from a glance, like, okay, so I probably can't handle this right now. And then enemies that are on your level are just the regular white, which is what Bubba Sknarks is would be right now. And the uh, enemies that are below you were like blue or something, which is a, a, a friendlier color. So, if, I mean, some games do that. Like, for example, Skyrim, you can't just go wandering good. everywhere because if something one-shots you, you know you're gonna die. But in this case, life. it just seems like, you know, like you said, they're all just challenging. I got a sponge blubby. It gives me health what regen. Is that? Uh, I don't know, it looks like maybe cake? I don't know why. Where? It looks like a jelly. Sir, where on your body did you hold cake? In his trunk. Are you saying that because he looks like a tree? Probably. All right, Bubba, it was, it was good meeting you. Let's continue on our magical journey. Magical journey to the next place where you can just, you know. To Pebble. We're going to Pebble. Oh, Kill hey. everybody. Don't mind if I do. But you need these to build things. I have not yet built anything, but you know, I, I will get to it. Mm -hmm. Um, Random people. Does he sell things? No, it would have had a an exclamation point over his head. Wow had that too. Gray much lower, white around the same, so on. Too yeah. high a skull next to its level. 
Oh yeah, that makes sense. You found the whereabouts, the deepest, darkest forest in the land. Okay, Sometimes that sounds horrifying. To see for all the trees. All right, well, I see a couple of random people. They haven't attacked me yet, so that's fine. Yet. Oh, I am I am just like stumbling onto things. This is where we are now. And uh, somewhere around here is where we were supposed to be the first time. Where? Oh. I need to go there. I mean, I don't really need a waypoint. We're going to the... Snaptrot? What? <laughs> <laughs> like, let me make sure I'm, I'm, I'm reading that correctly. Okay. Should I follow the road? I feel like all roads lead to... I feel like that's potentially dangerous. Oh, hey, another point I can't use. Sad face. Got plenty of rabbits in a hat, guys. I'd love to be able to learn a new skill. Is that or figure out what those things are. How the hell are we in ice already? How did we go from deepest, darkest... Don't trip it. Just keep Just moving. Um, what? Let's trip, trip it? it? Just trip it. Yeah, we're... Uh... Hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. I, I'm not in a place where it snows, guys, so correct me if I'm wrong, but... How... How... How do we go from like there's no there's no gradient? It just went abruptly into snow. That's not a thing that happens, right? You don't walk out your door and be like, "It's warm Some here," and then you walk down. Someone has made a nest. I think it was like that in uh, an ark. Fluff Hulk. Say what? I think that's the name of the thing. It was a Fluff Hulk. It was Fluff something, and I was like, "What the fuck?" Oh, the hoodie thing. Yeah, the bear in the onesie. Bear, the 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 lizard in the onesie. And Ark had biomes like that where you hazard just zone. Jumped. Zones or vast areas covered in deadly hazards. Oh. You can only whisk down the hazard for so long before it kills you. Oh. Okay. okay. Oxygen deprived dead zone. Gear and resistance you chose during character creation determines how long you can survive in the hazard zones. Oh, I I went with like a Mmm mmm leaving. I went with like a we're leaving now. It's a oh. Zone. Even a thick coat of fur is enough to keep you warm here. You mean isn't enough, sir? What? Um, tune the ping dish to locate the cold zone suit. Okay, so Great. even if I don't have the resistances, I can <laughs> get them. But yeah, the resistances are down there at the bottom underneath me. Um, 7% in cryo, not doing too great. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll do really well in purple glob thingies. I don't, I'm not <laughs> I don't sure know what, what that, that is. is. Oh, wait, is it Psy? Green is like the the other thing? It's not here. Huh, that's odd. Yeah, I think green is radiation. I don't know what that little moon rock is, but... It looks like Earth. Earth what? What, what kind of Earth is going to come at me? Yeah, I can't learn any skills, guys! The fuck? <laughs> Better keep going around and, and, and grinding. <sighs> I'm sad. There is not for me here. Can you swim? Well, he can. He's gonna drown. It's fine. Hmm. Yeah, he hesitated when I tried to... Oh, okay. He's like, are you coming at me, bro? Come on. Wow. <clears throat> He's just chopping wood in the middle of the forest for... Living his life? I mean, maybe maybe there's a house somewhere around here. Who knows? Could be stumbling onto a... You're at the quarrel spot. Just disgusting to see him destroyed. Um, oh, there's a bear in a hoodie! Heavy duty bonfire. Oh, I'm gonna... A bear, a lizard in a hood. Oh god damn, I'm in combat, I can't save. Yeah. I don't want- he is- guys, we're gonna look at this and not engage it, okay? This is- this is- a lizard in a bear onesie. Like, <laughs> holy shit. It's him. We found him. We found- the one that I had before, it was like a bear colored onesie. Like brown with like pink on it. Yeah. This. This ugly mofo. Oh god, I can't control the zoom. This ugly mofo. It's got a little smile on the head. It's got face. <laughs> I feel like me describing it doesn't do it justice. Like that's... It's so cute. That's fucking phenomenal. Oh, he said what? What's this other thing? It looks like a werewolf in a... It's in, in pajamas? A no, it looks like he's... In a superhero oh, outfit. Oh, you're a heavy duty bonfire. Why am I killing you so quickly? He's, and he's level 14. Like I said, there's no, there's no like, hey, by the way, you won't be able to handle these foes anytime soon. All right, heavy duty bonfire, fuck you. 
Or maybe he just has like very little resistance to fire, but this mm-hmm. weapon is just fire. Yeah. Now they just casually juggle this guy in the air. <laughs> like suddenly I feel stronger, I don't understand. We're gonna go back to the Komodo Dragon. Like, wow. what's happening? We're going over there. He is the second of his kind, and like. Is he over there? Yeah, they're beating him up. Look at that! We're going back over here. This is a fucking. <laughs> I can't! Like, I am so genuinely surprised so by the soothing. existence of such a creature and it's it's not like it, it actually fits it on its legs and it has a cutout for the tail <laughs> who's making them right who is making and a how are they putting it on them <laughs> oh wait is this ours i can't actually find it it's yeah. our time <laughs> it's a friend wow it might be the big ones yeah it's not attacking me Oh wow! It, yeah, might, he might be controlling Can I it. Can ride you? No. The air oh come on! Electric. Well, now I want one. Uh, huh. Yeah, <laughs> nobody's beating you guys up if you have that son of that a bitch right here. That is the most disappointing. Oh hey, let's think. I caught it. I don't know what it is. Keep it. Wow. Then he like makes a. Need that now, but you will later. Interesting. Or Did he just say that just because, or...? I, I don't know if that was in response to what I... But what are these? I caught it too! I'm just gonna catch a bunch of these. Again, I'm not sure what I'm doing, but I'm doing something. Okay, well that was a weird fight. Where's the... Oh, where did he go? Little... Oh, he's stuck. Oh, He's in yeah. the bushes. He's stuck in the trees. Now this guy, I need this guy on my side. Like, hey, you want to take a road trip? You look well adjusted. Oh, where's my my horse? Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. It smells just like raisins. Uh, it tastes just like raisins, Nico. Give it a lick. Gross. It's a great smell. Not licking horses. Of a stroke of a ma its mane, it turns into a plane, and then it turns back again when you tug on its winky. I can't find a winky on this thing, so I don't know. I don't think you tug. should, because it looks very angry. He's fine. He's a very gentle soul. Hmm. His Famous name last words. shall be. Um, I almost said Mortimer, but I have a Mortimer. Uh, his name shall be. Grim. What's an epic name for a mount? That looks like a, uh, you know. It looks like a goat from Satan's hell. mount. Look at its eyes. <laughs> he gives no fucks, and he's majestic. Wow, 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 wow. I like him. I mean, he's, he's certainly better than a weird, ugly black thing you had earlier. That yeah, just, there just definitely eyes were and a giant people at smile. some point because there's absolutely no way. Exactly. So, would you rather? Oh, hmm. would you rather? Oh, money. It's time to do what's right for certain values of right. Ooh, ooh. Eleven thirty. So poor. <laughs> it's very difficult. Maybe you get better, you know, later. What did, what did Grim say? Oh, Slipnir. Slipnir? Yeah. Doesn't did, Slipnir didn't we have, have one in the. Uh, we had one in the. Doesn't in Slipnir have 14? two more sets of legs, sir? I mean, mine's a little disappointing in comparison. Smaller version of Slipnir. We'll, we'll call him. Uh, he's actually not a horse. What about a goat? Are there any famous goats? He's a chupacabra. This corner of the wow. world is called That's not even a goat. <laughs> which is maybe why they eat goats. Blake calls it home. What? It looks like the horse. Eight legs, but still. Okay, so that's three more sets of legs. <laughs> Bath is of it eight. eight? One, is another one. Two, three, four. Oh, it is eight. Yeah, we had it in Final Fantasy. Yeah. The Knights sure. Templar. shocked to see you. He said wow. about you, but figured you didn't have the guts to do what must be done to survive Excuse till the end of the world. Me, sir? Agrees, that's obviously true. Hmm. Figures someone like you must be willing to do anything to stay alive, just like him. Now that you've got this far, which way will you go? I haven't had to do much, just fight, really. You seem like you're ready to make the hard choices and do the worst things to see this world wind down right. Yes. Guess is the end is well. coming either way. When there's nothing but a bad storm rising, it's ride 
or die. I'm a ride or die. Asks you to think of the world like a set of locks. Every time you do something, you decide whether to open one or not. Would you go back and open different ones now? Um, I'm happy with where standing. Is that what he's asking? I don't. What's happening? Says worse is relative. What's bad for you might be good for him. True. Does he sell food? Looks like, Looks like the a food world's truck, yeah. going to burn. The brighter, Ooh, the better. Guys, we're here to watch the world like burn. Threw out the old plans for this world. Trying to start something new? Fire. He likes the Jagni you work with. He's liberated lots of things with them. And from them. You stole from them? It's not like they anything they have was actually theirs. And they don't lock it down. You look like you'd be a fun lock to pick. What? He says back in the days, no one locked anything. But that's changed. Locking I'm sorry. Yourself in next time, fellas, out next time you're in a club, I need survival. you to go up to a girl, okay? I need you to make eye contact. Business low key. But for the right Just... the gears mesh well between you. It'll be easier for both if you just call him Click. Okay, sketchy. Anyway, and I need you to make eye contact and say, Hey girl, you look like you'd be a fun lock to pick. And see how that works out for you. I just wow. I just wow, want, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I just need somebody. <laughs> it's too late for me. I can't hit on Nico. She's hmm. she's Nico. So wow. anyway, what can you do for me? Says that's the right way to ask that question. Think of yourself first. Click is the devil on my shoulder. Click says his key to success is metal. And judging from what he's heard about you, you're handy with metal too. Literally. Handy? You mean like a fist on my back? If you charged a bar of metal at a Toxanol zap station, he could forge it into Ooh, the... Ooh, he powers up my clock fist! Just the switch of a generator hmm. that produces... Yeah. He thinks the... I am all for it. It's close to here too. Hey, hey. Anyway, I would really like for you guys to see the morality system. System. Um, just the silly conversation they have when you make a moral choice because it, it, it's... It's funny to me. It, it really is. Much like a, a dragon in, or a lizard in a bear onesie. Darkness it's just one of those things where you're like, world. what? But I haven't made a decision in some time. Oh, yeah, there's a town. <laughs> Ooh, shiny. I was wondering what that balloon was in the distance. Now, are these allied or? Eh, I guess it doesn't matter, does it? <laughs> They're about to be. You could have missed this village. It's called Mamble Clump. Mamble Clump. Interesting. Welcome to Mamble Clump. <laughs> All right, area objectives. There's a broker for weapons. Are there any items that I can pick up? I'm just gonna poke around a little bit. Just a little bit. We're just gonna, a little. Hmm. We're gonna we're gonna find all the things we can find. There's something on the other side. Oh, I'm just in someone's house. You know, I don't know if you've seen it, but when, when something is important for you to interact with, it's that little that little faintly pulsing dot in the background. So if ever you can't find an objective, just walk slowly until you see one of those, is, is how that works. It's a little strange. You think they'd, I don't know, make like an arrow or something? Ah, nah. Scrap. Always happy to find that. <laughs> something you can see, you know, but... Uh, tiny oscillating circle is good enough. Faintly oscillating. That's uh, lag. Just a tiny bit. Just a... just a smidge. What is this? And why am I running with my fist? Uh, we're not attacking anyone, honey. What are you doing? You know, calm down a little bit. But Getting if ready. I can upgrade this, I'll be happy! Uh, thinks oh, it must have been thing. hard to lose your parents. What that did to you as a kid. I'm sorry? Do I know you, sir? How do you know I lost my parents? Do I just have lost parents' face? Offers you extraordinary prices for extraordinary things. <laughs> so sleepy. Melee base types, melee parts. Yeah, he only has parts, so you actually have to craft. I'll show you guys the craft screen. I. Oh, so they do just want me to talk to people for whatever reason. Just to okay, get, so... get familiar. I guess. A little weird for a tutorial type thing. So here on the craft screen, you select one of the available parts on your fuzzy little body and you, you craft things. 
you can either craft something entirely different or you can modify it to make it better. Um, add-ons you find all over in the world and they actually reflect on your your gear which is pretty cool I enjoy that that's that's like my thing um hmm. that looks like if I was wearing it that would be directly over the crotch in this area cod wrong? piece <laughs> a cod piece yes that's that's the word that's a little strange. I can add things to the back and to the arms and just... So if I wanted to wear this Ronin top, on, let me let me figure that out real quick. Uh, I'm not in love with it. The tall neck jacket, I've always liked this. Currently I have 17 armor, so if I just increase this a little bit... Oh, but it also... It also lowers my resistances. Nah. You can also dismantle things so that you can actually use them to upgrade other things. Like this. Okay, it goes up to 19. That's great. That's fantastic. Yeah, you kind of need... you need all the help you can get. Okay, let me try that. And then... Oh, I can actually have quite a bit of it. Huh. None of my elements are changing though, unfortunately. I'm just gonna use the best things I have, right? That makes sense. Um, do keep in mind- oh, that looks silly. Do keep in mind that at the bottom there it, it shows you uh, how many of your resources you need, so you can only, of course, attach add-ons as long as you have the resources to do so, as well as the parts to do so. So I'm gonna add these- that's a stapler. That <laughs> That's a stapler. <laughs> and it makes sense because, you know, you're, you're taking things- oh, that's a critical chance. You're taking things from a world that once existed and making them into something usable today. So there we go. This tall neck jacket is now Rick Rack 3 quality. Don't know what that means. Wow. Uh, abnormal rarity, which is good, probably. I don't know. But it's a plus. And now I have my totally customized jacket. I wish I had a different mouthpiece. I've only found this. Huh. It won't let me. Oh, I guess I can't affect it. Yeah. So that's all I've got. My face, by the way, looks like this. So it's a bit of an improvement, actually. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. What about the pants? What what kind of pants are we working with? Just the Jagney? Ooh, I've got very skinny legs. I should like the jeans. No, we're 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 good like this. I would like a different faceplate. But other than that, I, I'm I'm happy with my appearance. Question mark. Could be better. Could be worse. Much like this world. Oh, here's the other vendor. This is Sir Peddler is eager for you to have a look at the you wares. Were. I'm no, here for your wares. Think Another you good line. Like, hey girl, I'm here for your wares. To make a good deal here. Mm. What's good here? <laughs> nothing. I have nothing. Oh, okay. Oh, I like this. That looks neat. Tabby skirt. How much? Yeah, you are so broke. I'm so broke, yeah. A creaser shirt. Discarded Roni. Oh, this will go with what I'm currently wearing. Hmm. Yeah, I need money. I can only afford these things down here. Another backpack, jacket, anarchy. He said, "What are you buying?" <laughs> you mean what am I looking it's for? It's all about destiny. Yours, mine, the entire world. I can't afford anything, Grim. Spoiler alert: I'm broke. I feel like that wasn't really a spoiler, I feel like it's a known known. Hmm. I talked to you. What? Why is this guy keep doing that? The Lupin was the only thing that happened to ruin your life. Okay, how does this guy know about me? This is a mailbox. Oh, you know. He knows. Paper drunk. And a health back. Okay. He knows all about you. Like, people will just comment on your life. Like, sir, have we met? Like, what the fuck? And I'm the unspoken hero and therefore the Everyone knows who I am and about my life, but like that's a little strange. Oh, chest. Just following those tiny little tiny little circles. This looks tribal. Okay, I gotta talk to two more people. I've already gotten Oh, shiny. Listen, I'm all about these chests. Plop top safari. That's an that's odd thing, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do think that actually. A little bit. I thought I saw something to, to swipe up just now, but that was wrong. You know, some random creature to kill or keep. 
I'd like I'd like for someone to explain that to me. What what are these little beasties and what do we need to kill or keep them? Feltic scrum. What? Ooh. That's a big one. Pipe wrench. Oh, it's rare. It's it's a weapon. It's a honest to god weapon. No, it's a handle. Okay, so if I wanted to buy the weapon crafting is actually pretty cool. Like I said, I haven't made one as of yet, but like it, you take all sorts of parts from different different majiggers and I'll show you now. So you pick a handle and it actually, when you're using it, shows. Yes, you can use a plunder as a weapon, who wouldn't want to? Um, but base type, one-handed, one-handed, one-handed. I have all one-handed? Really? Let's uh, let's select some parts just to just for the sake of saying that we did it. This is radioactive, which is good. And here's a pipe wrench I just picked up. I can use that as a handle. So now I have a knife that's made of a pipe wrench and an actual knife. Interesting. I can add screws to this. I can add uh, a pencil. Want to put a pencil on your? Yeah, man. Let's let's have a pencil on the side of this knife. And there you go. That's what you. I don't have enough to craft it. Like I said, kind of been hoarding things. But yeah, this is this is our weapon. This is completely usable and when you are actually fighting people it will look like this so i think that's pretty cool you can make any sort of odd silly or just mundane object and and take it and beat people to death with it normal sentence that's yeah <laughs> it's a mm. normal sentence nico i need you to i need you to leave me be but if you've ever wanted to take a plunder and beat an animal to death this is the game to do it in all right so i'm glad we had this talk <laughs> Thank you for coming to my TED talk. I don't call that a TED talk. Hmm. There, there, was, there was no information being exchanged. It was not enlightening. You were expanding your mind. It was just, just me remarking on something remarkable. Oh, that's real close. I should go over there. I can swim across the lake. Just kidding. No, you can't. We get halfway the sun there and is coming up fast. Yes, I would get halfway there and drown. There's not like a boat over here. That's such a neat concept. Oh, yeah, I, I really enjoy that. I wish I could use it more, but like I said, I don't have the necessary parts. I'm sure if I spent more time galloping around the map and actually um, kicking over those little totems you've seen me get parts from, I could mm -hmm. eventually like craft something valuable. But until then, I'm just going to use my regular stabby stabby. I mean, the, the fists have been working out. Let's let's stick to something that works. Oh, pee time! Wow. <laughs> Let's see. Let us. Gear wear upgrade bench and weapon upgrade bench. Oh, I know where those are. They're um, that 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 blimp thing. Where is it? Yeah, that. That just follows you around. I guess there's just one docked in every area. I mean, that's that's. Helpful. So if you come up here, you can upgrade your equipment. So if you happen to like your current your current weapon, then you can use it here. Now I couldn't upgrade the fist because that's a tool technically. You can use it to fight, yes, but it's it's main main um I don't have enough, of course. So I it's... have an explanation for those weird little animals. Oh you look it up? Yeah. Because people were curious about it, I guess there was no solid explanation yeah, they mentioned I feel like they mentioned like some sort of weird beastie but they never said like hey if you catch them catch this many then you'll start the end of the world or some shit like it was never so there are five related trophies related to catching animals in this game you will Ooh. need 20 of each and more or less all species are easy to find Ex -ex uh, except the glitter moths before you go and hunt some make sure you finish the story related quests which takes says you should team up and take over the world or what's left of it which takes you to hunt these so i guess as you go along to the story it's without revealing oh, they anything want actual oh okay you you'll come across species you know on your own interesting i mean i've caught a it's too bad it's not retroactive here's kitty hey. say hi bella oh it's yeah, you're nowhere near it, but apparently mm -hmm. this guy says, Beware that fireflies do not count as glitter moths. Only the white ones count. So, if you come across them, catch She's only the white locations. ones. The but yeah, so 20 of each, blind. and I, I believe there are trophies involved. Okay. Cool. Which you do like, so. Do, do what you're doing. 
<laughs> Went to visit Nico. I tried to flip her over and she was having none of it. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> this is a baby. Um, hmm. I was saying something before you discovered the, the meaning of life, and now I don't remember. You were on the, the blimp and you were facing the bench. And I didn't have enough parts, right? Yeah. Oh, just that the main tool, which is the fist that I'm currently using, which is also helpful. We're gonna upgrade that. We're, we're gonna upgrade that and then probably call this a stream. Again, I would have liked to make a morality decision, but I didn't see anything that would have been useful. Yeah, they're not as common. You don't come across them. Okay, Pull that the looks like it's activate done. the power. Pull the lever, crunk! That's a Toxinol zap station. A what? Toxinol zap station. I mean... Toxinol is who ended the world, by the way. They, they did some... Toxic shit. <laughs> they um, they did what humans do, and you know, pushed progress forward. And unfortunately, progress got away from them. That's all. I'm yeah. sure there's a moral here somewhere in the story of Bio Mutants, but you know. Oh, so there's not going to be any enemies at eight, nine side points. What kind of bullshit <laughs> is that? Maybe I'm not playing enough of the story. Like maybe I'm too busy trying to do side quests that they're like, hey, guy, if you stay with our main thing, then Probably. we'll give you all the power you need. You know how sometimes it's locked behind it that you won't understand how and when the best time you should use it until you go back to it, maybe? Okay, you're going to need two things to take on the triple-headed porky puff. A what? A triple-headed porky puff. <sighs> we're doing that next. We're, we're if getting... If it doesn't look menacing... We're getting a triple-headed porky puff, Nico. That's... <laughs> I... I don't... I don't even... I don't even... Charge the metal with lightning. Huh? Just flip the switch of the generator to produce superheated glowy air and get on it when the light falls. Superheated glowy air. I feel like they're just describing it, you I know. I need to stand here? That doesn't seem safe. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it does. What? How do I actually... I'm, I'm here. I'm... Ooh. Um. Okay. Something happened. It said circle. I hit circle. Oh, hey. You might need this. You're gonna get zapped by lightning. Yeah, there's, there's... Oh, okay, so I did it right. You just have to follow the circle around until it actually has lightning over it, and then follow the prompt. Okay. Hmm. This doesn't seem safe. Well, you know, I mean, you're, you're already a mutant, so... Oh, there we go. Oh, no. That's not a... What, a, what, a, what is that? It's a good question. It's sassy! Um, it's, it's going to kill you. <laughs> He's exposed! Where's his name? He doesn't need a name, honey. He's, he's whoever you want him to be. And why are you gendering this creature? You don't know what it is. What it's all about. It's got a lot of help. Yeah, it does. And it makes a scary sound. Scary stuff, scary stuff, scary stuff. Ding! Head on. Yeah, man. I, I shoot good. It's <laughs> not like I'm actually aiming. I'm just kind of... Maybe I should try punching it. L like I said, I'm always wary of the bigger enemies because I feel like they're going to come right up to me and just be like, POW! Right in the kisses. Yeah, this is working out too much. They're just so unexpected. Like, you don't know what to expect when you're punching it because it could just could oh! beat you down to a pulp. Whoa there, you know. crazy guy. Let's not charge at me like a wild animal. I'm the animal it's here. I'm actually not sure what you are. A being made of lightning. And thunderbolts. Very, very frightening me. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Galileo Pizarro. Oh. I'm paying attention. The Biazo Glove has a devil set aside for me. No. Mm -mm. None of that. None of that Shocking sleeping. development, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Shut up, Grim. <laughs> <laughs> He's so lame. <laughs> oh. Too close. We're almost done here. His health bar is slowly. There we go. Slowly but surely. Let me just uh, get my. Oh, I can loot him? Loot! Is it something useful? What is Gooey Glace! It's another cake. I don't know where these monsters are hiding cake, but I mean. I don't want Do you cake. like cake? Yes. <laughs> You're not gonna do the rest of it, Nico? No. I do like your ass. And yes, I would like to eat cake off your ass. Wow. <laughs> Well, now it just sounds weird without the rest of the quote. <laughs> Still made you laugh so hot. Mm. 
multi-tube mask. Don't I already have this? That might be better than my current mask. Uh, it's a little better. It's interesting to look at. Okay. Bella will be taking over the stream. She's facing the entirely wrong direction. I'm not sure what she's looking at. <laughs> Shards of metal. Uh, wow! Am I gonna get another one of those zappy things? Come on. Oh no, we're we one! Good, Damn. But the lightning oh. did all the work. Head back to click to amp up the clonk fist. There you go. Excuse nice. you? I defeated a zappy thing. I, 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 I beg to differ. I did plenty of work. Did you? Uh, and also, uh, what? I totally selected the wrong button there because I expected, yeah, the, oh. I caught it already. But, you need 20. But I didn't have the main mission, so... Oh, like, okay. What? I mean, you'll need them, so I guess you should, might as well Are they retroactive? Up. I don't know. I'm just going to catch them. <laughs> they're, they're, they're here. <laughs> Bella, excuse me. Go back across the river and call my horse. Note. Ah! Got you this time. Wow. Thought you could sneak up on me, you big old. Ah, oh, yeah, damn it. Alright, not going that way. That's a bad. It's a bad time. The animals enjoy Biomutant too. Side note. Hmm. Oh. It's stuck. <laughs> I still made it. Close enough. Don't look that beastie in the seers. Is that how you say I? Feel eyes? Like, I feel like the way this game describes things is the very literal sense of the word. Well, like yeah. lightning is zappy zap or something. Or eyes or sears. Or they describe. Oh, there's another thing. Oh. Bubba snaps! Wait, didn't I kill you already? Bubba? I mean, oh. there might be more. That might be just what it is. Goodness, look at it. What is it though? Uh, you are getting smashed. I, it's not doing much damage, but I dodged that. How did fuck? you? I did. You didn't dodge it. Enough. I did. You didn't dodge it enough. You didn't dodge it enough. Nope. Uh, this is the maximum amount of dodge that I have in my life. Well, ago. you need more. You're gonna need more dodge. Maximum dodge! Wow, that did suck. quite a bit more damage. Um, uh, look at well, that. I guess so. Yeah. Wacko. This this is great. I'm very excited to level it up. I'm just saying. Gonna go fisting things. Wow. I'm, I'm not into that. I don't judge anyone who is, but I'm not into that. <laughs> the copper touch. Face fisted. Face fisted. Oh no. That's what we call a punch. Oh my. I'm gonna face fist you. Tickling toffee. Is that what that said? That was tickling toffee. Yes. Do you not enjoy toffee that tickles? No! Oh. You and I are in com two completely different wavelengths. Wow. I don't know, I feel like tickling toffee would be, um, like cold medicine? You know, the, the lozenges that are supposed to numb? Oh. Right? Yeah. Yeah, you just punch open sofas, that's normal. Saber. Rick rack quality. Whatever the hell that means. It's quality of rick rack, duh. Okay. Rick rack is the best. So I've been thinking. Oh no. Excuse you. Anyway, and I'm probably going to be featuring this on the channel some more, yes. But um, I was going to play Bug Snacks, which is so cute. So very cute. Uh, for those of you who did not follow it, it kind of, it was like announced around the time when PS5 was first being like hyped up and everyone was like, hey, get your PS5 for $1,400 now because I'm a scalper and fuck you. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> So that's going to be another thing I'll add to the channel. There I'm going to start... Up ahead far worse than this. Great. And I only mention it because it's it's currently on sale and I wanted to make like a video of the games that are on sale in the um, days of play sale that people might be thinking of getting and like why I think you would enjoy this game if you were the sort of gamer that I am. So look, look out for that, those of you who follow the channel. Are there any more houses here? What the hell was Bubba Knumpf doing in this place? Or whatever the hell his name Protecting is. Protecting the memory. I was already in here. It's real hard to tell if you've been in the building or not. They're all very derelict, decrepit, etc. Did I come in here? I don't know. And there are things I'm looking for too. It's a giant garbage can. Oh, Gray and yellow tunic. Oh, that's not bad looking. It's terrible for you though. It doesn't do anything. I mean, if I upgrade it, it'll be alright. I haven't been breaking down. I know I can get materials from breaking down stuff, but I haven't been doing it. I just 
have a problem with letting go. <laughs> I I do. I will fully admit. And this. and how's your inventory doing? I don't have an inventory limit, so Uh-huh. Nico is a hater. I just know how terribly she, you are she with is the... in, She is in constant disdain of the with things With inventory that I do. management. I can't be good at everything, Nico. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't you just support me and accept me the way that I am? As the a way hoarder? that I are. A little bit. Wow. It's a mental sickness, Nico. I can't help it. Hmm. Did you hear something roar just now? Not I feel like Grim would disagree. Grim's gonna side with me because Grim loves me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Drop everything. I mean, it's not like a horse to go careening off the dam. Did I pee on this? <laughs> Let's find out. I did not. I must pee everywhere. Let's see. Wow. I feel like that's a lost opportunity. He could say something funny every time I peed on a stick. I'm just saying. Or a post or whatever you want to call this. Like, you need to drink more water. Seriously, though. You need to drink more water. It's What's happening? Radioactive. Here? The future is in your hands, so take care of it. He's standing in my pee and saying that, but okay. He might be drinking it. <laughs> ew! I, I understand this is survival, but ew! Oh. Huzzah! So he just has a stand that does this on the side of a road? Mm. All sorts of people come through here. Oh, it looks a little different too, it's red. Whoa, 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 this isn't about me, this is about you. <laughs> Excuse you! The click says your fist is charged and ready oh to my. punch a hole through anything that stood in your way in the past. A very oddly specific. The clicks worked out yeah. the locks of the world, but still needs to make the keys. Hmm. He figures he could make a skeleton key. A key that'll unlock any a back old in time lock bone? if only he had a back-in-time bone. Wow. I just noticed those keys on the floor. Is he, was he like a key smith? He's talking about remains of the dead and gone. And yeah. that means a chill down your spine as this bone comes from a particular site. The gone forevermore. The gone forevermore. Wow. I'll send a chill down your spine if you sidetrack Wow. <laughs> Thinks you might have unlocked the secret to his plan. Oh, Lord. All these lock Lock-Dope jokes. says you're locked together in fate. <laughs> I can't. All right, we're we're locked together in fate, guys. I'm I'm gonna lock this stream down now. <laughs> I'm about ready to get some something in my belly. So thanks for joining me. This has been Bio Mutants by THQ Nordic. It came out um, in May, very quietly, mind you. Open world RPG doesn't take itself too seriously. Combat's pretty good. The monsters are ridiculous. Crafting systems are awesome. I wish I had more materials, but. Eh. And the world is pretty, albeit a little empty. Um, join me next time when I stream. I'm probably sometime next week. Just make sure you subscribe and turn on your notifications so you can see when I'm around. Stay in the know.